are mad. You are a goat. You must be very foolish to think I will allow you carry this Boropo's cat on inside here. And you must be very senseless to think I will make way for you to go in. What is wrong with you? Is it because you're driving this thing? No, you wait back. I am talking to you. You are not going inside. I will go before you. So stay back and watch me. You mad. Jeku! Jeku! Open this gate! Were you there to support him? Even if I wasn't present physically, because I was out of the country, ask him. I supported massively the cows, the canopy tents, the celebrities that perform. Oh, keep it quiet. Was all my money. Keep Stephanie. quiet. I equally supported him financially. Yes. I was there to make sure everything was okay. Where were you? Really? Huh? Eh? Tell her to live your life for good. Oh, keep quiet! Shut up! Will you both keep quiet? I have warned you not to come to my office and I'm, I'm, I'm be misbehaving. Huh? Aren't you girls ashamed of always doing this in my office? Huh? Sorry. Please. Who is your sugar? Are you mad? Are you crazy? Baby. Don't, don't, don't mind this stupid girl. Look at me, Steph, it's your baby. You know I love you. I will, I will. If not this girl, fooling herself. Enough. Enough. Haven't I warned you to stop coming to my office to do this nonsense? Huh? Please. It's this girl that did not go to school. That's oh, keep quiet! Raz. Who is Raz here? Yes. I can slap the hell out of you. Both of you, keep quiet! Now get out of my office. You out. Heard? Yes, thank you. You heard him. Didn't you hear him? He said, get out of his office, Rita! Are you mad? Hey, he hey, said, get, get out! Up, get, up, get, up. get out! Hey, I said that both of you should leave my office. Baby, I mean both of you. Enough of this nonsense. Baby, out! Will you tell him get out of his office? It's a joke! Out! Out! out. <laughs> nonsense! Can you at least pick up that call and hear the young man out? I don't want to hear him out. I already know what he wants to say. He wants to tell me how much he loves me, how he's going to spoil me, do this, do this, do this. I'm not cut out for that crap. You know, men are generally wicked. They are scum. And I will never fall for anyone, no matter how sweet the person sounds. Wow. And I'm going to ask you a simple question. Have you been with all men? Yes, because how on earth did you know that all men has come? Give him a chance before, before you, 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 you classify him among the men that has come. You're sounding as if you don't, you don't have a phone. Are you, are you not on the social media? Are you not seeing what's going on? How some are being beaten to death by their husband? How women are being maltreated all in the name of relationship and marriage? Are you not seeing all of that? Do I need to be with all men to know they are scum? They are generally scum and wicked. Yes. Okay. So I don't want to experience any of that. If I die single, it's fine. I just want to live a happy life. Okay. But I pray that you meet a man that will sweep you off your foot someday. <laughs> That's hilarious. <laughs> oh, could that man possibly be? It's not possible. Listen, any day you hear that I'm in love, hmm? Remind me, I'll give you one million naira. Wow. Wow. Now, this is betting. And I am so much interested. I can't wait. Do you know this, this stupid guy is still calling? Babe, please now, pick up his call. I won't. Okay, should I help you talk to him? At least, I will pretend to be you. Let's hear him out. Let's hear what he has okay. to say. Why? Why would you want to do that? Because I'm looking out for you. Where's your phone? 
Attend to your guys. Allow me. I'm not caught up for that crap. Well, son. The zenith of this meeting is to remind you of returning back home to come and replace your father, the late king. Now that the mantle of leadership rests on your shoulders. And the throne is rightfully yours. You need to think home first, Fred. And that's what your mom has been trying to tell you. I've heard you. And I'll make plans when it's best suitable for me to return to the village. Okay. What? My, my prince, you don't need that comfort to plan anything. You just come home and mount on the throne that I've been waiting for you. There are things to take over. And your mother has been holding brief for you all this while. Oh, no. Yes. Mother. Just like I said, I will make plans on when it's best suitable for me to come back home. I can't just abandon my company. I hope you understand. Oh, no, who did you hear that? Imagine what a praise of a land is saying. Have you getting any sense from him? Is there any hope? I believe he knows what is at stake here for him. Because he wouldn't want the cabinet chiefs to call him for a meeting. What do you want? And if you ask him about any close tie with any good girl, he will start telling you about heartbreak and all what not. Come on, mother. You know my experience with these women. It has been chaotic. I've been trying my best. Look, I don't just want to bring home any kind of woman in which you, my mother, will criticize the living daylight out of her and remind me my place as a prince. So please, allow me. Be patient. My queen, in this area you have to give him some time. Looking for a wife, it's when you will know that all the girls you've been meeting I know we are close to wife material. There you go. <laughs> no. In that case, I have to look into it too. It's not a problem. It's okay. What is going on here? Stephanie. What is the meaning of this, Stephanie? Why on earth are you blocking my gate with your car? What is going on? Nothing is going on. I came, but your gateman won't let me in. Let you in for what? Huh? What exactly do you want us to talk about that we have not already talked about? Huh? We agreed to move on with our lives. No. We did not, Fred. We did not. Maybe you're thinking I was where you talked to. Maybe it's that stupid girl, Rita, whatever her name is. I don't care. Come on, Fred. Why are you doing this to me? Move your car out of my gate. No. What are you doing? Fred. Please. Oh, please. Oh, please, no. Fred, Fred. No, no. You are embarrassing me. No, wait. This see, is a, get I, off. I, I really want to apologize for everything oh, that I have done to you. Just please don't give me. Please, can you get up? I don't care. All I need is your listening ear. Give me a listening ear. All right. I, you have my listening ear. All for right. real? Just, just get up. Get up. <laughs> it's okay. Just... Can you move your car out of the way so that I can get into my house? No. Jeku? Sir? Open the gates. No! Why? I'm not moving my car. How can I move my car? You said you're going to give me a listening ear. I have to move driving and then you drive in. Please, Fred. Please, I beg you. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. I will give you my listening ear. Thank you. Okay? Do you want just this one or that one? I want both. Oh, please. What? 
You can confidently watch what you made. That's your handwork. Keep watching it. Aren't you proud of yourself? I know I did wrong, Fred. Mm. Please forgive me. I, I, I beg. Mm. I've forgiven you already. Of course. If not, there's no way you'll be in my house with me, seated this way, talking. Okay? So, so, let's just agree to move on with our lives. What are you doing? Right. No, you don't have to sit back down. Please. What, what are you kneeling down for? I know, I, 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 I know I was wrong. I was wrong. I, please, forgive me, I beg you. Right. Stephanie, please, don't even piss me off. Don't get me mad right now. If I was the one in a bar for looking with another girl, how would you take it? Would you even take it? How would it make you feel? Hmm? Bad. Good. I'm glad you know the right answer. I know. I know, Fred. That's why I say I am sorry. I meant every word I am saying. I am truly sorry, please. It's my bad. But we, we, we actually met at a wedding and, and we started discussing along the line. Who ran this, this video in your phone? But it's gone. Look, please. I have nothing else to tell you. But you, Stephanie, you know that I am not the kind of guy that would let this slide. I, no, I, Get out of my house. Right now. No, 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 no. I, I know. Out. <laughs> We're done. Oh my God. Stephanie, Fred. no. Fred. Stephanie. Jesus. Why can't you melt my heart? Show me the reason. Sam, Sam. Yes. This our chair is far apart, so I will not be shouting if I want to talk to you. I can hear you now. Oh. Sammy. Yes. Me, I know you've been cutting eyes for me since, but there's nothing I can do. You know I love Fred. Eh? Me cutting eyes on you? Yes. No, 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 no. When I had my eyes on you, it has long gone. It expired the day you went out with my friend, Fred. Uh. Yes. <laughs> so you mean that if I come to you <laughs> and kiss your lips, <laughs> you still not want me? Uh, please, this is not what we are saying. I thought you came here to tell me I should help you and talk to my friend and know how he will come back to you. So why are you saying another thing? You talk too much. Hmm? You're shouting. See, why don't you take me inside? You know, lead me in as a gentle man that you are. Sam hey. Sam. Yes, <laughs> Samson. Sam Sam. <laughs> One and only something. Okay, I should read you like a gentleman. I see. Come with me. Oh. I should behave like a gentleman. Of course. I'm already gentle. Now that, you know, how are you going to help me? Help you? Why are you still talking like this now? Look, once I get to my guy's house, I will talk to him. <laughs> There's no two ways about that. Thank you. Thank you so much. Eh? You're welcome. I appreciate you. You're Thank welcome. You. As far as I'm concerned, you are the chosen one. You are the chosen one. <laughs> Uh, so, 
Um, look, look, look. Fred is my very good friend. Once I get to his house, what is that? Why are you looking at me like that? You see, I liked what you did upstairs. Mm -hmm. Yes, it was so, so nice. You like what I did upstairs? Mm -hmm. You want it again? I want us to do it again. I'll go in here and <laughs> Listen, this time around, as we are going there, I want you to crucify me. <laughs> if possible, tear me apart. <laughs> <laughs> I don't even know why you are still crying. Hmm? Look at the things I bought for you. LV. I had to beg Amaka to order these things and ship them down from America. They are very expensive, but I don't mind. Smile now. Sugar, please. I'm sorry. Forgive me. Eh? Why are you doing like this? See, I got all these things just to make you happy. Still, you are frowning in your face. Really? Fred. I am the one that suits you as your princess. Please, my love, forgive me, I beg you. Eh? Really? Really? Do you think that these things will make me change my mind? Hmm? Did you imagine that I would change my mind because of this these things you brought here? Sorry. Let me let me transfer money to you. Maybe you don't like LV. Can buy Prada or Balenciaga. Please, eh? I'm sorry. Stop. Enough. Stop. Okay? I'm the one that is supposed to be doing this, not the other way around. How did you ever imagine that we could be together again after the shock you gave me? Oh, you're preparing to give me another shock? Part two? Shock Pro Max? Huh? Who doesn't want to have anything to do with who? And who gave you a shock? Look at the things I bought for your friend. I've been begging him. Please forgive me, forgive me, forgive me. What did I do that other people have not done and they forgave them? Help me talk to him now. He's still frowning. Oh, this for my friend? Yes. Riza, excuse us. Yes, I will. Give you a call later. Okay. Just go, okay? Go no. home. No, 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 please. Wait there, yeah? You like it? No, please take them with you. I don't want any of this. Please, take them with you. Wear them. You're I going to like them. it. Especially this one. I love you, baby. Plenty sacrifice for love, nigga, dear. I fit to do anything for my love. I fit to do anything for sweet and animal. You were with me, love. You were with me, you're my choice. What you have to do with me? Now you burn my heart. You were with me, love. You were with me, you're my choice. What you have to do with me? Hey, big madam. Welcome, ma. Welcome. Welcome. Why are you there? Welcome. Welcome. What's up, Fred? What's up? About Instagram, Facebook. Please don't start with me. Oh. Look, Fred. You have to think about it and know what you have to do with these girls. <laughs> what 
are you doing here, you boyfriend snatcher? Stephanie, you know you are very razzled. Eh? What's all these shenanigans? If I were you, I would have shame. Eh? What are you still doing here? After they caught you making out with your boyfriend in public, in a bar. You are you are yeah, you keep quiet. You must be very, very stupid and silly for saying that. What is wrong with you? Rita, what's in your work, you dear Chris? <laughs> please, 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 I don't even have time for nothing. Jeku! Ma? Jeku! Oh yeah. Mash this thing out of here. Wait till they happen for here! Wait till they happen. Best never get admission. You know they find roommates. Which camera be this? See, I'm gonna let like this kind of know. You know they like him! You know they like him! Jeku, tell this idiot. This good for nothing, I don't even know how to describe it. Tell you to make it get the hell out of this place. Are you mad? You don't call, you don't call raise voice for me. You. <laughs> you see, you your type are supposed to be in this room. What are you? Who let you out? Oh yeah, Jeku, take out of this place. And the next time I see her in this compound, I will sack you. Before I sack you, I will beat you up. Oh yeah, match. You will what? Oh yeah, out. Try it out. Try it out. Richard, try it. I'm gonna let this guy you. Are you mad? I'm gonna let this guy see you. I don't wear low. Sam, Sam, yes. what you just said now is unacceptable. And please, do not push any further. Please. Fred, all I'm saying is that we should give her another chance. Mm. Everyone deserves a second chance. A second enough. chance indeed. It seems like you've suddenly forgotten what she did. Huh? Should I remind you? Fred, she didn't commit a crime. Everyone deserves a second chance in life. Except you are the devil himself that you can't for forgive. What is wrong with all these girls? Oh, Jesus Christ. Lord, help me. Can't I have my peace? Hey, stop. Can't I have my peace? Hey, son, good afternoon. Uh, you heard what he said? He said he need peace. Son, please, I heard him. Um, hey, hey, stop, stop. Fred. I'm leaving. Go now. Ah. Sam, I want to talk. Fred. I said I'm, I'm leaving. Ah. What just happened? Why didn't you want to give her a listening ear? But you gave Rita an opportunity to talk. Yes. I believe she's the reason you're avoiding Rita. After all, she's the one that came for you. Instead, you, you went for Rita. exactly are you doing here? Don't you ever listen? Because I've sinned against you and it's been disturbing me. But I told you I've forgiven you. From the depth of my heart, I have forgiven you. Fine. Then, then accept me back, please. No. Give me a no, second no, chance. No, no, no. No. How long do we keep doing this? Huh? How long? Have you seen it? Have you seen it, Fred? You love me so much. But you're keeping it back. You're holding it back, Fred. Hello. Wait. Steph, where is this coming from? Are you okay? Yes. Yes. I'm okay. Because I... I heard you and Sam talking about it yesterday. Wait, wait, wait. wait. Eavesdropping is bad manners. And you know it. You know it, Steph. Fred, can't you see? Open your eyes and see. Can't you see that Rita has bought the heart of Sam? Probably she, she, she has bought him with gifts and money 
Can't you see? That's not my business. It's not my business. This, this, this is my business. And you're disturbing me. Okay? What? I need to get back to work. Fred, why? Why? Why are you doing this to me? Why? Is it because I was the one who came after you for the first time? Is it because I was the one who came to ask you out and not the step, other way around? Step, step, please. Look at the amount of work I have. I beg you in the name of God, allow me to be productive today. Please. Are you telling me that it's a crime for a woman to tell the man how much she loves him? Let go. Step. Look at me, please. Oh. I'm sorry, for look at me. Get up, Steph. No, I, I have work to do. Fred, I beg you. Get, I'll I call beg the you. I look, beg if you. Look, if you don't leave, I'll call the security. I'm, I'm dying. You're hurting me. My heart is beating. Stephanie! Please, I beg you. Fred. Security! No! Security! Stop it! My lover. I fit to do anything. Fred. What's the way that? You don't have to listen to these girls. They are trying all they can just to get into your school. And Steph was eavesdropping on us yesterday. How is that possible? She was at my office today. And what did she say? She was talking about you supporting Rita instead of her. Even if it's true, does she expect me to support her after what she did? Don't tell me she's getting something out of you. She's getting nothing. But I kind of had sympathy on her because of the way she was talking. Sympathy on her? That should be wonderful. But you have to be very careful. It seems she's manipulating you. How? Because I told you what she said? Because you have a soft spot in your heart for her. I believe Rita is up this short and not her. No, Sam. I'm the one who decides who gets any spot, not you. I'm sorry, my prince. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It's my heart. Show me the reason why I should love you. Now it's my heart. Show me the reason why I should love you. What I need is love and peace of mind. Can you give it to me? Money not be everything. Make a for I need peace of mind. Money not be everything. Make a for me. I need peace of mind. Rushy, rushy. Fire, fire, my God, all the horses. Help me, help me. Bari, 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 all the ham, ham, ham. Rush, rush, fire, fire, all the horses. Bari, 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 all the ham, ham, ham. Now me, you must marry all the horses. Bari, 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 all the ham, ham, ham. I don't do any. Get to you on the horse season. Marry me, marry me on the ham, ham, ham. On the horse season. On the horse season. Marry me, marry me on the ham, ham, ham. You must marry me on the horse season. Marry me. I'm not a mechanic, but I'm sure there's one or two things I might know about faulty starts. Okay, let's see what the battery returns. Let me try. Keep the key. Oh. Thank you. You're welcome. Please keep an eye on that area where I touched. Is there a spark? Um, no. Okay. Yes! <laughs> oh. Wow. Oh. Thank you. Oh, God, 
started. Thank you so much. Thank you. You are welcome. Thank you. you are welcome. I'm glad I could make it work. All right. Okay. You are most welcome. Glad I could help. So what's your name? My name is Sonia. Sonia. And you? I'm Fred. Thank you so much, Fred. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. See you around. Bye. Okay. Bye. Bye. Drive carefully. I will. And you too. All right. Let my heart show me the reason why I should love you. Melt my heart, show me the reasons why I should love you. What I need is love and peace of mind. Can you give it to me? Money not be everything, make a brief for me. I need peace of mind. Money not be everything. I need peace. Mm -hmm. What is it? Your calls sound so urgent. Yes. Has Fred finally decided to forgive me? Uh, yes. Um. Why are you touching me? You're making me uncomfortable. I don't like it too. I don't like it. My dear, you are the one making me uncomfortable here. How? Okay. After the last time we met, I have not been myself. You have been on my neck. I can't even breathe in peace. I can't even think very well. You are a man now. Control yourself. Which one is I can't think? Don't you have girlfriend? Eh? Good. See, you, you are going out of script. This is, no, this is not our agreement. I only did what I did to ginger you to help me. Uh -uh. Rita. What is all this? Hey, Rita, I, I understand. See, Rita, even if I have a girlfriend, my girlfriend will not be as sweet as you are. Please. Um, you know, what you did has turned me on. I can't even control myself, please. Uh, ah, ah. I... Sam! See, you are killing me. Okay. Are... Hey, hey, Sam, now stop. Move yourself. You must marry me on the whole season. Marry me, marry me on the whole season. Grace, when last did you check on your fiancé? It's about two weeks now. Why do you ask? What? Two weeks? Yes. Two weeks, Grace. What about if something happened? You say, um, now one witch or whatever, I don't know. Why? <laughs> we are very busy with our work. Busy for you to check on your fiancé, Grace. <sighs> <laughs> Wait, is there something that I'm missing that like you're not telling me? Well, I just, um, ask because I quality know you too well. Please check on him. I'm just saying nothing. Thanks for your concern. You're welcome. So what's about that top I, I asked? <laughs> Let's go to my house. Mm, I'll give you. Sam, I can't continue this madness with these girls. I mean, prince for God's sake. So much is expected of me. I'm under pressure from my people. I don't even know what to do. I'm confused. Huh? Right. Hey, 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 hey. Don't advise me to get another woman. Please. Because I have not gotten rid of the two that are hanging on my neck. Fred, I am not advising you to go for another woman. Rather, I am telling you to make your choice. Then stick with it. Others will move on. Than having your hands fill up with these girls all the time. If you ask for my advice, I will say you should go for Rita. Why 
Are you suddenly drifting towards Rita instead of Steph? You never looked her way before. Well, I thought about it. And I realized that you have a better chance with Rita than Steph. Because you may not be able to control yourself if another ex-boyfriend of Steph comes into the town. I think you're right. You have a point here. But Steph, you know, I see sincerity in Steph each time she comes to plead. You know? I think she's honest. So what do you see in Rita? Someone pompous, arrogant, full of herself, you know, showing off her wealth, riches, just to intimidate others. You know, a liar, a cheat that is just pretentiously hiding her bad behavior because she hasn't been caught. Have you seen it? This is the reason she said I should come and talk to you on her behalf. Because she believes Steph has given you something to eat. She gave me nothing. Look, it was all natural, okay? And I just, I just feel sympathy for Steph. I'm not the type that can be swayed by pension things, by the way. It was all natural. Very well then. Let's see how it goes. Nami, you must marry. On the whole season. Marry me, marry me. On the whole season. Yes. I know I didn't tell you. About what? There is this girl I met recently. Ha! Sam! <laughs> Another girl. Oh, more they plenty you. <laughs> You should just hurry up and get married. Let me know I'm the only one left. My brother, I'm waiting for you now. Once you get married now, we'll start thinking of that. Another new one. Meanwhile, I did my own JJ Joe. When this girl can carry a overripe mango, way sweet like waiting, I don't know. Come give me. Oh boy, this one I chop and clean mouth. No, I don't chop clean mouth. She still keep coming. Coming. <laughs> Who is this girl? Do I know her? I met her in PH when my company went for a conference meeting. Yes. So since then we have been communicating. She keep coming. Ne belu, ne eh? belu the time. <laughs> you. I know you will not let go of this free Wi-Fi. Oh yeah? Eh? You won't let go. Thank goodness you know it's a free Wi-Fi. Hey. I have to connect immediately. If not, another man will connect and even change the password. Lock me out, Steph. So I have to connect. <laughs> I don't do anything to get to you on the whole season. Marry me, marry me. Babe, are you not happy to see me? Why won't I be happy to see you? Hmm. But your reaction speaks differently. Uh, which one is reaction again? that you know I miss you. Really? Yes, of course. When last did you come to check up on your wife to be? Sweetheart, you know the nature of my job. There is no way I can forget you. Even if I do, who will I have? Yes, of course. So let's go. Now me, you must marry on the whole season. Marry me, marry me. My love, how has life been with you and how are your parents? So bad that you have not asked about my family, especially my mother that loves you so much. My love, I have told you that my job is taking the best of me, but I will try and make out time for us. As a man, you have not missed your wife to be. You have not felt it in your vein to invite me, if not that I came. 
Unlike before, you will not allow me to rest from the door. What is going on? Eh? Has someone taken my place? My love, no one has taken your place in my heart. Like I said, do not worry yourself. We are staying all night and we have the whole night for ourselves. I will try and make it special for us. Okay? Your love for me has subsided. What is going on? I know that you don't love me again. Sweetheart, I love you. You are all I have. I can swear with my life that I am not seeing any other woman except you. Hmm? Please, my sure. love. Stop now, stop now. Am I not here now? I have really missed you. Hmm? Why are you not mean to see me? I miss you too. Uh, so, can I have a little bag or kiss? Mm -mm. I'm not kissing you. Stop now. Mm -mm. Stop no. now. Why are you doing this? Oh, should, so we, I'm not kissing should we go inside? You want it on bed. Nami, you must marry on the whole season. I don't do anything to get to you on the whole season. How are you? Be nice there. Okay. So, when are you leaving? What kind of question is that? Did I tell you that I'm leaving? Oh, I'm um, sorry, sorry, sorry. Never mind. I'm just asking. Okay. Well, I have called my office to extend my my off to next week. Why? Babe, are you not missing me? Baby, please don't permit me. I want to stay with you. But I'm concerned about your job. We don't need to. <laughs> see you. I miss you. Keep going. Okay. In that case, I will see you later in the evening. Okay. Okay? Mm. Take good care of yourself. Thank you too. Bye. Nami, you must marry on the whole season. I don't do anything to get to you on the whole season. Yeah, we met accidentally. Her name is Tonya. Tonya, this is my friend Sam. Hi, Sam. Oh, Tonya. Oh, you're welcome. You're good to go. I'm good. Okay. Thank you. So, um, can I take your number again right. this time? There you go. Thank so you beat me so I can have yours. Sure, right now. Okay, um, we're about to hit the restaurant now. If you're not doing much, why don't you join us? I have an emergency. I wish I could, but unfortunately I can. I need to leave you again. All right. Please, we'll do this some other time. I'm oh, stay in touch. You're always welcome. All right. Okay? Thank you. All right. Bye. Take care of yourself. Bye. You too. Now you must marry on the whole season. I don't do anything to get to you on the whole season. On the whole season. You are not eating your food. And why are you staring at me like that? I keep wondering what could change you. How do you mean? Everything, Sam. The urge for me is not there. Even when you make love with me, as if I force it on you. Is there something that I'm not doing well? Tell me so I can improve in that area. And if there's something that I did wrong, tell me I can plead for forgiveness. Grace, 
we are having internal issue about money in my office. And the whole error is channeled on my side. That alone can push me into something else. I am deeply sorry. And I promise to make it up to you. I believe you. Thank you. Can you eat now? Sure. Or should I feed you? No. No, you are a very beautiful girl. Thank you. I remember this food is very sweet. Thank you. My daughter, I have been meaning to ask you. Were you serious when you said you won't have anything to do with a man again? Yes, I am serious when I said it. That's because I love my peace of mind. I don't want to be in a relationship where I would have to cry every minute of the day. I don't want to be with a man who will probably hit me at any slightest provocation. Then how can you meet your life partner? Or are you expecting God to throw an angel from heaven for you? Mom, <laughs> it's not just about getting married for me, it's about finding a good man. And it's rare. And this is the time you have to seek the presence of God. You have to seek his presence to help you make the right choice. Mom, so all the productive things I have to do with my time is to start praying for a good man. The man should pray for me so God will send me his way. Tonya, my daughter. You have to sow on a fertile ground. When you sow on a fertile ground, you reap. You have to keep loving and living. That's part of life. You know my story. You know how, what I went through when I met your father. It wasn't easy, but today we all are enjoying it. We are enjoying from the level. Hmm? Huh? Don't worry. <laughs> so near. <laughs> Don't worry, okay? Why is Rita always going to my mom's house like this? Imagine Sam leaving his office to see that useless girl. My dear, maybe they are putting on um, planning important business. What kind of useless business is that? Eh? There's no business. He's afraid aware of it. That area is where you will not go. Yes, <laughs> because all fingers will be pointed back at you. So it's a no-go area, trust me. That means what they are doing is not genuine. I don't know. No. I, I didn't say that. No, no, no. What they are doing is not genuine. Bruce, I don't know. You don't know? I don't. Okay. They are coming. I do do it. Mr. Fred. <laughs> Grace! Uh, yeah, yeah. I didn't know you were around. When did you arrive? I've been around since four days now. Four days? Yes. And Sam said nothing. Wow. This is unlike Sam. <laughs> wow. How are you? I'm good. Okay. Good to see you. Thank you. Well, I'm about to head out for lunch now. Do you mind joining me? No problem. Good. But I think Sam is seeing another woman that is taking his attention from me. Whoa. Okay. Um... Do you know any other woman in his life? None that I can think of. Um... Look, there is none I can think of, okay? But I'm sure we can talk about that over lunch. Let's go. You look good, Grace. It is obvious you did not go back to your office today. Why did you say that, my love? Your love? What is it, Grace? Do you want to kill me? Why is it that everything I do this nowadays you will find fault in it? Why? That is simple. Because you have changed. But I have explained to you how it all came to play out. And I promise to change in due time. Okay. Let me go back to what I asked you before you change the topic. 
Okay. It seems that you did not go back to your office. I did. Just that I was trying to finish up with some certain things before coming back home. And why are you asking? It would have been a shameful act if we were in your office and you're saying this nonsense. Grace, where are you driving at? What is going on? There is no way I will spend about three hours in your office and nobody told you. Even if your colleagues are new, they all notice me. We even communicated for a while before I left. Oh. Oh, that. Wow. Who was the lady that you left with? Oh, okay. Wait, wait. wait. Do not lie to me that she came for a business. Because people in your office told me that there was no such thing in the book. Grace, are you now monitoring me or you are paying someone to do that? I will not pay anybody to monitor you. Do not defeat. Answer my question. Okay. The lady I went out with was uh, Rita, one of uh, Fred's friends. They are having issues. So, she came to ask me to help her plead with uh, Fred on her behalf. Uh -huh. Yes. <laughs> no problem. Are you, okay? Are you okay with that? I believe you. Nami, you must marry. Adi Hosiza. Adi Bi, Adi Bi. Adi I don't do anything to get to you. Adi Hosiza. Adi Bi, Adi Bi. Tony, why are you moody? Baby girl, I'm not happy. There's this guy that... Huh? <laughs> what? I haven't even started talking. You've already started laughing at me. What happened? Mm -hmm. I'm sorry. It's not like I'm laughing at you, but... I'm actually laughing at the fact that... You are being stressed because of a guy. Ah! Behold how the mighty has fallen. <laughs> Gina, you will not understand. I will understand if you make me to understand. I won't make you understand anything because you've already started laughing at me. Come on, I was only kidding. Just give me the gist. I'm kidding about my mood too. <laughs> I'm happy now. No gist. Please, Joel. Don't give me hanging. What happened, Sam? He didn't let me know that Grace was around. A lot on my mind. It totally skipped my mind. Why won't it skip your mind? Huh? While you were busy connecting to your free Wi Fi. <laughs> oh, boy, you have to be careful. Your woman is in town. You don't want to mess up that beautiful relationship with that great girl. Hmm? I'm being more careful. Good. Did you run into Grace? Yes, she came to the office to talk about you. I took her out for lunch and she was just complaining that it seems you might have found another woman. Huh? You mean I'm jealousy? It's not about jealousy. I think her instincts, she's, her spirit is speaking to her like something is wrong. Probably, you know, maybe you changed your attitude towards her. I'm already working on that. Good. Uh, you remember the girl I took out for lunch? Tonya. Yes, 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 yes. What about her? Uh, I've been communicating with her. Uh, frequently. Ha! I go work. Anyway, you're a gentleman. That's Lion's way. Not that. Look. She's not even giving me listening ears, you know? She never replies to my messages. I mean, something is not connecting. Don't worry. Do you know what you're going to do? Since she's not giving you listening ear, give me her number. Let me help you and fix her gearbox. And when you finish fixing her gearbox, 
you will now move into the entire engine. No, okay? no, 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 no. <laughs> Don't even go there. Look, there's there's something about her. She's still not so comfortable. It seems like she's afraid of something. You know. That's what I'm saying. Just give me her number. I promise you, before one week, you'll see her on your apartment. No, Sam. Thank you very much for the offer. Huh? Thank you. This one is special. Hmm? Huh? This one is special. My guy. I think it's time we should go now. I don't know how to tell you about this again, Sam. Oh. I've said it's time without number to stop living like this. You can be dressing like one commoner out there. You are a prince for heaven's sake. Mother, and I've also said it time after time that I should be left alone. This is the way I want to live my life. And it's not an issue. It's nobody's issue. Come on, Mom. I told Dad earlier that I don't like any of this stuff. Any of this royal motorcade, the maid, the, 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 the apparel, all that. I don't want it. This is exactly how I want to live my life and everybody should just let me be. That's that. Please. Well, I want to remind you that we, the elders in council and I had a meeting concerning you. To get a woman so that they can talk about my coronation as a king. If you knew about it already, why are you not doing something towards it? If it is that difficult, Mother, I please, 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 please! Come on! How can you say I'm not doing anything about it? Huh? I'm the one that needs a partner the more. It's more important to me than anyone else. <sighs> All right. Um, it's okay. Um, Fred? Oh, uh, I went to this occasion and uh, I met with this princess. Oh my word. She's so homely, charming. Her thoughts melt hard. Wow. I get talking with her and we exchange contact. So since then we've been talking, and um, I would love to give you a contact. Oh, there way. you go again, mother. I promise it won't be like the previous girl. Mm. She's not anything close to her. Believe me, oh, you need to see this girl. She's so lovely. I know. Well, in the world. Mother, this I've... is the same way you were confident about the last person. The same way. Um, but I assure you, joy is one in a million. I assure you, you can never make a best choice for my woman than myself, mother. Okay. I'm so glad you got all you wanted, all you needed. Oh, yes. Or should we go back again? Uh, um, no, we are good. We actually do not need anything, but because you insisted, we decided to pick a few. So, well. Uh, okay, so, like I promised you, today is going to be a day of stops after stops. So, our next stop will be the Chinese restaurant. Oh, my God. Master Lee Chinese restaurant. And Chef Master Lee is my friend. He has promised me an exclusive meal for us. Whoa, Are you ready? So, yeah, of course, we're um, ready. Good. No, can we? Yes, um, we are ready. We can actually go with you. Look, I promise you, Tonya, you will love the meals. Chef Master Lee is a professional and he's going to make you love every bite of his meal. Oh, oh yes, of course. We, we can we go. Yeah, we can, we can go. Awesome, awesome. Um, so, uh, yes. Can we go with my car? Um, we can actually. No, um, I'll drive. I'll, I'll drive behind you. Oh, really? Yeah, I, I can't leave my car here. Yes. That's true. Yes. That's true. After, we can, we can after actually... him, yes. Oh, okay. Right. Okay, ladies. Oh, really? Okay, fine. Okay, yeah, we, so we, just be behind me. Right behind me. All right. Okay. Now me, you must marry. 
Are you sure you're concentrating? Because you've been smiling since you're driving home. What is happening? <laughs> My dear, I'm happy and I have all the right to be happy. You know we're not hospitalized, we are fine, so okay. right? Okay, but can you at least tell me why you've been smiling? Girlfriend, you're looking for gossip and that gossip, I don't have it. <laughs> I am not looking for gossip, but I noticed you've been smiling like someone they you know, someone that has been touched in some secret places she <laughs> she she desires the most, you know? So please tell me what I need to know. Oh god. Okay, now you want to hear something from me. When you go to your boyfriend's house and have conversation, do you discuss that with me? Hey, voila, voila, voila. So what are you trying to insinuate? Is it now about boyfriend? <laughs> Tell me because just me to know what is happening. Nothing is happening. I just want you to know that God is good. <laughs> we need to celebrate. God is good. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we'll start giving things for each other. No what? I say you're not going anywhere. You are not living here. Grace, what is the meaning of this? Huh? I say you're not living. You're not going anywhere. Huh? What's your problem? Listen to me, Grace. You have been acting strange since you came here. I'm acting strange? Yes. Between two of us, who is acting strange? You can say whatever you want to say, but you're not living here except you want me dead. Hey, listen to me. Mind the way you use words. You can say whatever you want to say, eh? It's not my business, but you're not living here. Grace, leave my way. I am going out. I don't know what has come over you. Why would you say something has come over me? Because you want to go and see that useless girl. Hmm? You want to go and see Rita? Eh? Come on, leave. Where do you get that from? That means you don't know the girl you got. Eh? Anyway, you can go. Well, I was only going there for a meeting. Meeting? Yes. But to clear your doubt, <laughs> I'm not going again. I'm going to go to the Let's go inside and kill, kill ourselves. We are each other. You will see it today. Come inside. Nonsense. You want to go and sit down Fred, how could you do that? Concerning my happiness, I owe no one no apology or explanation whatsoever how I enjoy my life. Fred, you have girls you are trying to sort things out with. And you are hanging another one on your neck. Come on, you have to man up. Hey, stop it. Sam. Don't you ever speak to me in that manner again. That you are my friend does not give you the moral right to tell me nonsense. I'm a prince. Don't ever forget that. Okay. Where are you going to? Sit down. Sit down. Well, I just remembered that you are a prince and you have right to make any decision you want with your king's men. So there is no need of me giving you a worthless advice. Come on, Sam, don't sound like that. <sighs> Look, I have a lot in my head. I just, I'm a man. I just need a time to think. That's why I left the palace to come here. I'm sorry I spoke to you in that way. Okay? That's not problem. I understand. Let me just finish up my work and then we can go for a drink. It's okay, it's okay. Come on, man. Don't be like that. You're still my man. Of course. <laughs> <laughs> Uh -uh. You're now. Fine, ma. Is your girl in? No, he's not in. Uh -uh. Do you know where he went and when he's coming back? Madam, I don't know where he went to. He's not uh -huh. in. Jeku, what is it? Why are you franging your face? Why are you raising voice? <laughs> Today no be Sunday. Oh. How are you doing? Today will be Sunday. I'm 
fine, man. Please, is my baby inside? No, he's not in. Now, there's something I just told Stephanie now. Thank you. What is my business with what you told the ghost? Eh? I'm talking to you. Is Fred inside? Today, no, be son. The moment I can't go. No quarter for him. I don't know the moment I no quarter for him. Your mother is a ghost. Your father is a ghost. Your generation I is a ghost. Son, the moment I go. Idiot. Ghost nation. I don't blame you. I have told you before. You are too ras. Leave this guy alone. Eh? Follow your type. They are everywhere. <laughs> Rita, I don't blame you anyway. Probably because you're wearing quiet clothes and that's why you're coming to show yourself. Come and take that thing out of my way. Let me get the hell out of this place. I am not moving. I want you to fly. Fly above the car. Rita, come and take this thing out of my way. Where I said I am not moving. I need you to fly. Plenty sacrifice for love, nigga. So, Mom, what was the new meeting all about? Um, there's a new development. So, you have to plan on relocating to the palace. I can't be attending the meeting with the elders in Kensal while you're round and grown. All right. I Besides, they are not happy about it. It's fine. I understand. So when are you planning on relocating? They will see me when they see me. <laughs> Fred. Mother? You talk like this because I am your mother. Do not speak like this to the elders in Kensal, else they will find you. All right, I copy, okay? Is there any other thing, Mom? Because I'm famished right now. We have to get eaten. Perfect. I will let you know other things. Besides, after the meal, I will leave the two of you to get acquainted. This is Joy. Joy, Fred, my son, Hello. Princess Joy. Hi. Mother, you're full of surprises. Well, that is why I am the queen of this great kingdom. And that is more reason I love you so much. <laughs> <laughs> you may leave. Mm -hmm. And uh, I'm back. Yeah. What did you say your name is again? Uh, Princess Joy. Princess Joy, yes. Princess Joy, and um, which kingdom do you hail from? Omochida. Omochida kingdom? Yes. Interesting. And um, what about your parents? Everybody's doing just great. Mm. And... Why are you interrogating me? Interrogating? Yes. <laughs> Come on, Fred. We're meant to be getting used to each other. True. Like, get to know each other better. Not this questioning and answer. Don't you think so? That's exactly what I'm trying to do. <laughs> get to know you better. Don't you have any question for me? <laughs> no, not at all. Really? Yeah, the Queen has already told me everything I need to know about you, and that's fine. Interesting. One more thing. No, the last one, the very last question. After this, no more. Can you tell me how you met my mother, the Queen? You ask again. Come on, a simple question. How did you meet my mom? Just want to know. Oh. Like I said before, Fred, I met your mom at a king's son's wedding. Mm. Are you okay? Are you satisfied now? Maybe. Maybe? Oh, you're so... <laughs> anyway, Fred, do you like what you see? Yeah. Did I meet your taste? What's your taste? 
Do I meet up with your taste? Maybe. Plenty sacrifice for love, negodi. I fit to do anything for my love. I fit to do anything for sweet animal. Fred, why are you doing this to me? Why are you treating me like an outcast? Why? Steph, what is it? What do you want? Really? What are you saying? Like you don't know what I am saying, Fred. What are you saying? Like you don't know what I'm saying, Fred. I'm talking about you and your new girlfriend. I saw you both the other day. Why? Really? Yes. So is that what it is now? You monitor me? Yes. I now monitor you. Because what you are doing is not good. Eh? I'm, I still have this one to battle. And you're adding another one to the list. Is it good? How dare you call me names? If I slap the hell out of you, Rita, your life will never remain the same. Trust me. Slap, slap me. You heard me. Try it. I will keep you where your types are kept. Hmm? I will lock you up. You know, Rita, you think you are made, yeah? You think you have money? Yes. Don't worry. Soon. Hi, Stephanie. I will expose you. I will expose you. I promise you. Free. No, wait. Excuse wait. me. Friend, I am talking to you. It is because of it that this idiot is talking to me. Friend. Friend. Nonsense. Yeah, we'll stay here and we'll come back to meet me here. I know you will not go far. Nami, you must marry. On the whole season. You must marry me. Stop. What is it again? Huh? What are you doing here? Fred, calm down, please. Look, Fred, I actually came to apologize for walking out on you at the office. Yes. I just can't stand really talking and arguing a lot of things. No. That's why I came to apologize. I am sorry, please. Apology accepted. Thank you. Are you happy? Yeah. Alright. No, sh sh should I come in? Goodness me. Steph, I'm just coming back from work. Can't you see? I'm tired and I deserve some rest. Yeah. Alright? Yeah. So, can you allow me to rest? Huh? Afraid. Good. No, wait, 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 please. What? No, what? I'm still what? talking. What? Wait, please. Yeah, you're going to rest, but don't you think it's time for you and I to sit and talk face to face? I don't think out between you and that you look into my eyes and look into your eyes. We sort everything out. Please. No! No, Fred. Hey, Jaku. Sir. Send this woman out of this house and make sure you lock that gate. Yes, sir. Okay? Yes, sir. Bye-bye. No, no, wait. Madam, Madam. Fred. Madam. Fred. Madam. Come on, get the hell out of my sight, it's yours. Fred. It's me, your baby, Stephanie. Madam, zero, zero that minus one. Come on, get, get the hand of this side. Madam, come on, be going. We look get, get, get the hand of this side. Fred! Madam. It's me, your Madame. baby step. Are you mad? Zero, zero, zero that minus one. Come on, be going, madam. Fred! <laughs> so if I speak, you not leave me here. This is your plan, Abby. What plan? That's why you've been avoiding me, Abby. What are you doing here? And Wait, what is this now? Who is this? Eh? What is this uh, one? Baby, let's just keep going. Whoa, I'm sure yeah. you. Whoa, yeah. Wait, wait, I'm He's sure my you boyfriend. Can... What? Yes. Don't listen to her, please. Please. Uh, Fred, what? what is all this now? You know I love don't, you. Don't embarrass me in public, please. What is this? I'm sorry. No, 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 no. This is not the time. Uh, uh, Tonya, wait. What are you doing? Inside. Tonya, wait. Tonya, what are you doing? Me, you must marry on the whole season. Marry me, marry me on the whole season. I don't do anything to get to you on the whole season. Hey, baby girl. 
Tonya. What's the matter with you? This is serious. Did you fall out with your father because I can't say boyfriend for I know you don't have any. Baby girl. Talk to me now. I know that you're here so that we can talk about whatsoever is wrong with you. And if we don't get to talk about it, how are we going to sort it out? Tonya, Tonya, I'm glad you're here. Look, it's not what you think. Hold Excuse on. Excuse me, Let me explain. here. What happened? What did you do to her? Um, we were together in my house, having a quality time. And an old friend bags in on us. Messed up the whole situation, okay? Whatsoever it is that you did to her, really got her pissed. Because... You can see. Yes, that's why I came to see you and found her here. Okay, please. Let's go after her. I cannot lose her, please. Okay, can we? You can lose her. And we're not going after her. We're not going after her? Yes. Why? I need to first of all know what the problem is. So I can tell you how to go about it. Oh, all right, um... Who? Oh. Chidera, This is called doctor's prescription. Hey. What do I look like to you? An ATM machine? No, do I look stupid to you? Eh? What is it? Am I a fool to you? Tell me, talk, talk to me. What is it now? Bring down your voice. Shut your mouth! You are in my house. Listen. I'm a very popular somebody in this neighborhood. Don't, don't raise your voice. I don't want my and neighborhood so what? to hear you. And so what? That I asked you to do a little task. Eh? Talk to Fred on my behalf. You could not do it. You have been taking my money and... and oh my me. Jesus! Eh? Am I a fool? You are even slapping me now. Hey, calm down now. What is it now? We can go in and sort this out now. Go inside and do what? Sort this out now. Sort what out? See, whatever it is you have to say, say it outside and now. Why have you not spoken to Fred about me? Why is first the way he is? Okay, I'm going to do it. Please bring them down. When? I will tell you what happened. Please. What happened? Let us go inside. I am not going inside. Start, Start talking. talking. We are outside. I don't want my neighbor to hear me. Let, me, ah. let us go inside. Ah. My queen. Honestly, I, I don't, I don't know what's wrong with him. Honestly, I am not happy. I don't know what is wrong with him. He's just treating me anyhow. He doesn't take my calls. He doesn't return any. Even my SMS, he doesn't even reply. Um, Joy, I'm so sorry there's nothing wrong. Believe me when I say that. You know, Fred is a busy person. Maybe you're calling at the wrong hours. Wrong hours? Mm -hmm. No, my queen, I don't think so. Because I've called in the morning, I've called in the afternoon, and I've called at night. Still, he will never pick or return my calls. I don't know. In that case, I have to call him to know what the problem is. Did you quarrel with him or maybe there was a loggerhead with him at some point? Not at all. I don't know why he's treating me like a commoner. Come on, I'm a princess, a gorgeous princess at that. I know, sweetheart. I'm sorry. I know how this feels. Okay? See, I've told Fred if he likes, he can keep 10 million girls there in the city. He is going to get married to you. And that's final. Because my word is born to purity and royalty. You say, my queen. Thank you so much. You're most welcome. <laughs> much, much welcome. My queen, yes, sir. Um, I don't know if you can give me his address. Probably I can just go to the city to see him. Oh, uh, that won't be a problem. However, I 
I don't know how he would take it. So let's do this, Joy. Why don't you allow me to speak with him? If he doesn't give me a concrete reason, then I will order you to make the mold. <laughs> perfect. Oh, very perfect. Cheers. <laughs> yeah, cheers. Mm. It's a royalty, <laughs> purity, and honesty. You can say that again. <laughs> it's a success. Mm. Fred. Yes. You like Tony and want to dumb Rita and Steph, right? Yes. Yes. Lately, she has been melting my heart. I love her. But still, I would work things out with Rita and Stephanie. Okay? I might even pay them off if they want. Because I will not allow anyone to ruin my chances with Tony. Good. Mm-hmm. Whatever you say, I'm in support, man. Thank you. I'm tired of those girls. Look, you need a fresh start. Someone you've never met before. And that is Tonya. But since she ran into Rita and I in my house and blew things out of proportion, she's, she's been giving me attitude. She's not been talking to me. She's not responding to my messages, my calls. What? Your house? What were you up to? It's not what you think, okay? I only took Rita over there, you know, to open up my mind to her and also to let her know that she's free from me. She's free to live her life, you know? Now I get it. But you never gave Rita any chance. Any girl in her position will react. Not the worst. That's why I have to end things with all of them. I don't want anyone to ruin my chances with Tonya. Girl, I'm so livid right now. I don't even know why I would give someone a chance to treat me this way again. At least you should give him a listening ear to explain himself. Explain what? What explanation does he have? From everything I've explained to you, you should understand that he has you at heart. You're now you're beginning to sound weird. How does he have me at heart? No, how? Please don't irritate me the more. If you don't have something relevant to say, I'll ask you to leave my house now. Okay, you've said that already because that is the only thing I have to say. No, oh, wait, wait, wait. I, I, wait, wait. I, I really do not mean it that way. But you just got me upset. Why would you say that? I've overstayed my welcome. I you need haven't. To leave. I just said I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I don't mean it that way. Okay, I take it back. I'm sorry. Why would you why are you angry like So that? are you are you going to listen to him or not? Tonya, I have to be honest with you. Let me open up to you. Those two girls came into my life differently, separately. I loved them and kept going with them till they both realized they were sharing one man and all hell broke loose. I tried to get out of it, but it, was, it got worse because I knew that I was not doing what my family expects of me as the prince of a kingdom. Hold on. You are what? A prince. You sound strange. You don't look it. You don't move around with maids, guards. You don't even wear royal attires. You yes. live a normal life. Exactly. You said it all. I love to live a normal life. Which has been a battle between myself, my family and my mother. I love to live the simple way, and they hate it. Okay. That's exactly the reason Rita and Stephanie 
has been on each other's neck fighting to determine who will be the number one the one that stays with me everything completely changed the moment I saw you I knew I found something like a piece of me that I've been searching for Well, I don't know what to say. Say something. I have nothing to say. Not now. <sighs> Gina, I maintained. Mm. But that was the highest shock of my life. Prince Fred. Mm. He's such a humble... Nice man. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And hope you're ready to give it a go this time around. Mm, not quite. See, I don't want to say, do you love him? Because that would sound so sudden. But do you like him? Of course. I like him a lot. And what if he comes all out? Are you ready to, you know? He's already all out. He has asked I be his girl. He's already all out. He has asked I be his girl. And what was your response? I told him it's 50-50. I'm keen about the ladies in his life. Tony, why not just go straight to the point and give him a straight answer? Why not just give him a straight answer? You amaze me. You think those women will just sit and fold their hands and watch you snatch him like that? What is your headache with women that Oh, see, I think Fred is matured enough to handle things. You get. All you just have to do is to give him the reason to ditch these other girls. By accepting him. Yes. Huh. And that reminds me. Please. My one millionaire. I haven't fallen in love. But you're about to. So please, my money. See you then, baby. Give me my money. Till then. Give me my money. My Til one million naira. Okay. Til Steph. Steph. What part of don't come to the office we cannot see today didn't you hear over the phone? Steph. Because I came for something very important. Oh my God. I've, I've, I've told you severally. I don't have time for us to talk now. Soonest, I'll call you so that we can clear the air about us. But for now, no, I'm working, I'm busy. What are you doing? Take a good look at I'm me. not. You're distracting me, okay? I need to get back to work. Why don't you take a look at that? Yes. Yeah. You see? Sam? Yes. You trust Sam and your stupid Rita over me. You trust them. I told you, Fred. I said, look at me. But you refuse. You believe them. Can you see? So that's the new catch you were talking about. But Rita. What transpired between you two? Nothing. Nothing transpired. She was doing all that to make sure Sam is on her side. That's why anytime you both are talking, he's always standing and siding Rita over me. Have you seen it? Your best friend, Sam. When were you going to tell me about it? And when did it all start? Who gave you this video? That is not the answer I expect, Sam. Sorry, I want to know. Because that person seems to be monitoring me for long. And that is inconsequential at this moment. Sam, when did you start seeing Rita? Goodness me! You're supposed to be my friend. You're more than a friend to me. You're like my brother.
Was this what you intended to tell me you got involved in? Sam? Fred, I know I offended you. How it all started is a long story. And even more shameful that I got myself involved in it. If it is possible, let's bury the hatchet since you're already moving on from the girls. Where is the trust, Sam? If I did not see this video, only God, only God can determine how long this, this nonsense would have continued. No, 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 no. It already ended. That was what brought about what you just saw in the video. I don't think I can ever trust you again, Sam. Fred, I'm sorry. Nami, you must marry on the whole season. You must marry me. What is the meaning of this madness? Why did you block my gate and still block my entrance? Sam. Sam. What is it? Sam. Who told Fred we have been seeing each other? Um, I tried getting that from him. Fred was annoyed with me. He didn't say anything, considering the fact that I have destroyed the long-term relationship I had with him and the trust he had on me. Whoever it is has ruined me. He or she has ruined my life. I swear, I will make life miserable for that person. Even if you make life miserable for this person, it will not change the damage it has caused already. What nonsense are you talking about? What rubbish are you spewing from your mouth? What I'm saying is very simple. And I want you to understand that Fred has moved on. You going back to him is embarrassing yourself the more. So I want you to let everything be by God. Did you say embarrassing? I will not go my way. I love Fred. Fred is my life. No, I cannot leave him. I cannot. Please. Um, Rita, please, can you, can you go and remove your car from that gate? I want to drive inside. Oh, brother Jesus. Again? Are you mad? I like that smile. <laughs> your teeth is white. Son? Mother. Mother. Let's go to the dining. Awesome. It's time for us to eat. Come on, let's go. Fred, why would you do that? Why would I do what? She stays off till we're done eating. What? I barely met her. Mother, what does that even mean? To the dining. Now. Plenty sacrifice for love. Love the world. I fit to do anything for my love. I fit to do anything for sweet and animal. You were when I be love. You were when I be You're my choice. But you're gonna be me. Now you dare my heart. You were when I be love. You were when I be You're my choice. But you're gonna be me. Now you dare my heart. Mother. How did it go? I hope you did not intimidate the poor innocent girl. 
Oh, you huh? mean the poor innocent gold digger? What is that supposed to mean? What happened? Nothing. Come on, Just mother. that I wonder where you meet those girls. Mother, what happened? What, what went wrong? Um, nothing much. I just found out she's one of them. One of what? Easy. Fred, you need to take me out of this place. I guess I've overstayed my welcome. Please sit down. No, I don't want to sit down. I need to leave before I say something I would regret. I understand. You leave. But can you just sit down so we can talk a little bit? Please. I promise I won't waste your time. Sit, please. I'm fast about it because every second I stay here irritates the hell out of me. First of all, I want to say I am sorry. I'm sorry for for how my mother treated you, okay? I am apologizing on behalf of my mother. Please. It's okay, but I need to leave. Sure, certainly, we will go, okay? But uh, just give me some time to sort things out, and then we can go. Whatever you have to do, be fast about it. The more I stay here, the more irritated I get. I need to leave. My prince, go and seek to meet with your guest. I won't go in there again. I will not. Please, take me home. If you won't do that, I would have to find my way back home. Tell my mother that we're coming. Okay, my prince. Uh, do I look like a joke to you? Am I kidding? No, you're not kidding, please. Just calm down. Remember, I told you about my mother's behavior. She's not doing this because of you. It's nothing personal. It's just because of her, her, her experience with many other women. I am not many other women. My name is Tonya. I haven't done anything wrong to your mom. Fred, take me out of this place immediately. Please, I am beginning to lose it. Then be you, okay? Do you. Be yourself. I know you to be a very patient and understanding person. I know you to be the kind of girl that will go to any length to get things done. Please, be patient. Wait until you meet my mother. Please, just give me this opportunity. And I'll be greatly pleased. Okay? I want the best for my son. Because he's king in waiting of this kingdom. Which is? You said you love my son and you can do anything to have him as your life partner. Why do you ask, my queen? Answer my question, Tonya. You're right, my queen. I love Prince Fred so much. I desire to spend the rest of my life with him. Are you ready to drop your status? What you think you are and Come stay with me here. I want to monitor you to know if you are suitable to be my son's wife. It is not easy to carry the crown of this kingdom. Are you ready? Okay. 
son. In all honesty, I... I feel bad whenever I see you looking depressed and heartbroken. Because girls have really taken advantage of you. They know you have a good heart. If Tonya is for you, what will know? How? Mm. You can pick your call, we'll talk later. Hello? So what happened to me? Uh, well, I don't blame your mother. But I understand the Queen's feeling. What she's doing is what every woman would do to protect her only son. Considering your experience with other girls. What are you driving at? Your mother asked I stay with her for a while. That she needs to stay with me monitor me and be certain that I'm good enough for her son. Monitor you? How? Like, what is my mother up to? Wait, what was your response? What did you tell her? I told her I would have to revert. I need to speak with my parents and tell them. But you don't have to worry yourself. It's not a problem. I will do everything to make sure she sees me differently. I believe she's doing all of this because of your experience. It's not a problem. Oh no, you now understand what I have to deal with. You see what I've been going through. Well, my prince, you have spoken well, really. But let me start from your simplicity. For that's where your mom, the queen, is always complaining bitterly. And if not for the fact that the elder spoke with you after the king's burial, most of us wouldn't have even understood you better. Exactly. Oh no. That's my point. It's not my style. That's not my way of life. I don't like all these maidens, security guards, all the royal activities. All those things are not for me. They do not please me at all. At all. Sorry, those are part of the symbols of a, of a prince, princess, queen, and even a king. It's necessary for your security. You never can tell anything, can you? Hmm? It's all right. Oh no. I would uh, find a way to adjust. So, fresh pan wine? Uh, <laughs> I think uh, I'm not in the mood for that now. Oh no, I am happy you are the one he came to see. I'm so happy about the things you said you told him on your way coming to the palace. I just hope he will listen. All the same, my queen. He's a full grown man now. And that's why we're forcing him to come down and take over as the king. And that is when he's married. Of course, but he still has the right to make a choice as a man. And as his mother and the queen of this land, I want to make sure that he makes the right choice. Oh no, I know what Fred went through emotionally. And I know what I went through with him as his mother. So I'm sorry I have decided that any woman that is coming into his life must come through me. Yes. <laughs> well, there is sense in what you have just said, <clears throat> my queen. You see, now that he's a full grown man that knows his left from his right, I believe that is why he came home with this woman. <laughs> because he has found her worthy of becoming the next queen of this kingdom. Till I certify her worthy. Like I said, oh no, 
Ichie Ahmadi of this great kingdom. You've always spoken well, but my word stands. Nami, you must marry on the house Marry me, marry me I can't do anything to get to you on the house Mother, you were hostile to her. Don't spoil my mood. I'm eating. And I'm not, as you can see. And I'm not in a good mood either, mother. I mean, how can you comfortably sit here and enjoy your meal when the only son you have, the only son you claim to love, is not happy? You want us to talk about it? Yes. Let us talk about it, mother. I am not a child. Stop treating me like one. Well, what your father would do, that's what I am doing. That's a lie. Papa will not treat my guest and I so bad. He wouldn't do that. If he wouldn't, then know it that I will and I've done it. Need I remind you what I said earlier? Any woman that wants to be with you, that wants to become the queen of this great kingdom, must come through me. And that's final. Mother. Mm -hmm. How do you sleep at night? Peaceful. Peaceful as ever, like a newborn baby. Nami, you must marry on the whole season. Marry me, marry me, on the humble. I can't do anything to get to you on the whole season. How was the occasion you went for? Go great. Yes, mom, it was amazing. I was warmly welcomed. Are you sure everything went well? Um, yes, Mom. Everything did went well. Why do you ask? The way you answered the question is either you are not telling me the truth or something happened and you are covering up for that. <clears throat> Nothing happened. If there's anything, I will tell you. Are you not my mom? Okay, I believe you. I need to make a call more. Right. I'll be in my room. Okay. Yes, I can hear you. No, 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 no. Son, in all honesty, I I feel bad whenever I see you looking depressed and heartbroken. Because girls have really taking advantage of you. They know you have a good heart. If Tonya is for you, we will know. How? Mm. You can pick your call, we'll talk later. Hello? Nami, you must marry on the whole season. Marry me, marry me. How is everything? Everything is amazing. Okay. I'm here to tell your mother that I've accepted her proposal. Her challenge, rather. What? You must be joking, right? I'm damn serious. Are you mad? Yes. I am madly in love with you. It's also an opportunity for me to see you often. This cannot happen. 
It will happen, my love, because that's the only possible means of having you in my life. I can't afford to lose you. Mothers can go any length to protect their son, let alone an only son. Wait, 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 hold on, hold on, please. Wait, how do you want to go about it? Listen, I'll find a way, okay? If I say no to your mother's challenge, she would do everything to destroy this relationship. This relationship will naturally die. I don't want that to happen. So, I'll do my best. You're worthy of it all, and I'm here for it. <laughs> Oh, today? Mother, why is she standing? Let the girls sit down. Frey. Yes, Mother. We've been talking before you came in. Manners, please. What was the last thing we said again? My queen, I said I am ready to stay here for you to monitor me. I've accepted your challenge, ma'am. All right, then. It has to be on my own terms. What are the terms? I'm not done talking. You will stay with the maids in their own room. Mother. No. Then she has to use the door and never return. Meanwhile, if you are remaining here, you are not allowed outside until I am done with you. Deal or no deal. Deal, my queen. More like it. Now leave. So tell me, what do you want to do? What of Tonya? Has she not come back? No, my husband. And her lines are not going through. And what do you call that? I don't know. Have you spoken to her friend Gina? No, but we do that later. Do it right away. I will. I want to know what she say when I get back. I'll be on my way. Plenty sacrifice for love, I fit to do anything for my love. I fit to do anything for sweet and love. You were my love. You my choice. Quit. Huh? What is it? Quit. Imagine girls. Hmm. For a girl to leave her father's house just to come to the palace to save, in order to get close to the prince. Wait, is that all you heard? <laughs> that means you didn't hear well. Then tell us the word you heard correctly, Rose. She didn't just come to the palace to get close to the prince. She came so that she can be the prince's wife. <laughs> Are you sure you're okay? Or the kwama? I am fine, I'm okay. Then what is she saying? I know what I heard. I think Rose is right, Jacinta. How? <laughs> for her to leave the palace and come back with the prince for the second time, my dear. <laughs> She's here to get the prince, oh. Hey, you see this place when I don't they carry me go where I know no. I they beg the boat of honor. I don't have hair in my armpits. Even down there, I don't have hair. Please, oh. Sorry, oh. I was not here when you both had this conversation. Uh, wait, Jacinta, you. you think I'm joking? Let her go. Shoma, this girl thinks I'm joking, oh. Well, we are all in this palace, and we are going to see it all unfold in this palace. We are here, mind that. Hey, go, let me go before they come out. Plenty sacrifice for love, nigga. Ah. 
Tell him, Tonya. Come on, cheer up. You don't have to listen to everything they said, okay? How did you know my name? I came around when Her Majesty was talking with you. So what's your own name? Mary. My name is Mary. Um, if you need any help in this palace, please let me know so that I can assist you on how to go about everything. Thank you so much, Mary. Lastly, do not listen to anything gossip in this palace because I know them. They can gossip for Africa. Thank you. Just cheer up, okay? I will. All right. Thank you. Plenty sacrifice for love, nigga. Dee, I fit the I fit the way that it for my love. I fit the way that it How can you say you don't know your best friend's way about Gina? Do you know that you two are like sisters? I know, Mom. But she didn't say anything to me. And what are you thinking? Ma? Um, n nothing actually. But I'm, I'm just thinking about where she might be by now. I'm, I'm worried. And when did she start behaving like that? Tonya, my child, is a well-trained child. She's well trained. Honestly, Mom, I, I can't say. I don't know. But I will make inquiries. about what is happening. It doesn't make sense. I'm sorry, this is no longer in your hands. She's made her choice. No, she didn't make the choice. You forced her into it. Forced her into it? How? As long as I'm concerned, she has every right to object. But she didn't. So? May I see you inside? Now. After you, please. Plenty sacrifice for love, nigga. I fit do anything. For my love, I fit do anything. For sweeted animal. Sacrifice for love, nigga. Oh, 
Prince, please, allow me to do my job. If your mother sees us together, she would definitely punish me. Calm down. Relax, okay? It is my mother we're talking about here, right? Not in this context. She's the queen. She has given an order, and her order I must obey. Okay. Please, All right. allow me to do this job, please. It's okay, it's okay. You will. It's just that you and I have not spoken in a long while. I can't do that right now. Please, can, can you just give me some time so that we can talk when you're done working? No, I won't do that. I left my parents to be here. I am doing this for a purpose. It's for us. Yes. I wouldn't have you ruin it. Tonya, come on. I'm the one you're doing this for. It is because of me you're in this position. Then let me do it. Allow me to concentrate, please. Okay, okay, fine. I'll just wait for you here. We'll talk when you're done. Please. Uh, I'm here. I won't bother you. I just want to keep you company. I'll think somewhere else. No, Tonya. Wait, Tonya. Plenty sacrifice for love, I fit to do anything for my love. I fit to do anything for sweeted animal. You were with me, love. You were with me, you're my choice. But you're gonna give me. Now you're my heart. You were with me, love. You were with me, you're my choice. But you're gonna give me. Now you're my heart. You sent for me. Yes. Um, the prince is outside with a guest. I want you to go serve them. Hmm? All right, my queen. All right. Um, one more thing. Don't mess things up. All right, my queen. Good. I love your mood right now. You seem to be very happy. Yes, you always make me happy. Really? Yes. <laughs> I wouldn't want to take that credit yet. Why not? Are you know my cute husband to be. Wow. <laughs> yeah. Well, I can say one thing for sure. You have a beautiful skin. <laughs> you can say that again. Everything for you, my love. So tell me. What are the things you do for fun? What do you, what are your hobbies? I love swimming. Oh, really? Traveling. Spending money. Yeah. Uh-huh. <laughs> Sounds nice. Shopping. Spending money. Yeah. I like to be everywhere. This is the drink. Um, thank you very much. Oh, thank you very much. What is it? How dare you? What How did... dare you eye me like that? Who is she? What did she do? Who is this commoner? Good for nothing idiot, this dirty pig. Can you imagine she eyed me like I took her man? Did I take your man? Uh, did I? Do you want me to give hey, you? A... Don't do that. Please don't. That's against my rules. Calm down, okay? I don't get it. Why are you telling me to calm down? You should be talking to her. Like she insulted me. What are you even saying? Listen, if anybody is to be punished in this palace, that is my responsibility. Because this is my palace, okay? Then do it. Start doing it right now. Because I will not have this good for nothing dirty brats. I mean like that. And you expect me to keep quiet. I will not keep quiet. It's enough. It's enough, okay? Control your anger. 
You can tell me to control my anger. This is how you give them the room. Oh, you still are you me? There's something wrong with you. Hey. Do you want me to beat your head? Enough, enough. Tonya. She's sticking with your heart. Tonya, please leave. You're even telling. Wait, 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 wait. wait. Why are you telling her calmly? You should give her a dead slap. You should give her a dirty slap. She's a woman like you. She's a woman like me. You shouldn't be treating her that way. Oh, really? That is wrong. You just do something. Down. She brought us a drink. She didn't just bring us a drink. You overreacted. There's more to it. Who tell me that? She... You overreacted. Leave me. Just leave me. Listen, the moment we pop this drink now and have some glass, we'll... everything will be fine. I don't want. Peck me. What? Peck me. What has that do with the way you feel now? Peck me, I'll break crazy. Just break me. Not tell me you're ready. Drama. I say you should It's okay. It's okay. I will. How about that? I'm going to tell her majesty. She will get it. She made that stupid job. Get to me. This girl is crazy. Marry me on the whole season. Marry me, marry me on the whole Everything happens like it. Tonya, why are you so worried? I thought you said you were going to see the Queen. I did. The Queen asked me to serve the Prince and his guest outside. Surprisingly, the Prince was with another woman, a princess. <sighs> oh, now I get the picture. It's not even about the woman. It's about how the prince stood there and watched her disrespect me. Rained insult, abuse on me. She almost broke my head with a bottle. Oh, my goodness. I understand how you feel. But I believe he holds a very big apology in the closest. Not yet, Tonya. I don't need his apology. I do not need it. I believe the prince knows what he's doing. And do not forget the reason why you are here in the palace. That's not enough reason for him to humiliate me to this extent. Well, I believe with time he will, he will explain that to you, okay? Tonya, I know you must have to face temptations and trials. You need to overcome, okay? Don't be too hard on yourself, please. Thank you, Mary, but I need to be left alone, please. Okay then, just take it easy on yourself. Mother, he owes me an apology. And with something really nice. Yes, I won't accept it. Son, did you hear her? Son, are you listening? Did you hear that? Mother, I have ears. You have ears? It's not all about you having ears. It's about you doing the right thing. Come on, you embarrassed me. You did in front of a common maid. A common maid. I, Princess Joy. Oh my God, I would take it. <laughs> I said I have heard. He's not happy we're dictating for him. Men with their egoistic nature. Especially him being the prince. Allow him. Hmm? Mother, honestly, I'm not happy. I am not. And I don't understand. I hope 
friend is not looking for an avenue to just avoid me and stay away from me because I, Princess Joy, I will not give him that breathing space. I will not. Oh, he's not. Of course, you're not going to give him any breathing space. Never. See, allow him to come around. Okay? So tell me, what do you care for? Oh, I really... I really want something really chilled. I need to calm down my temper because right now I am going from one to hundred. I need something really chilled. That's a period. Can you calm down? Now just shake it off. Yeah. That's nothing. You see that thing? She's a passing phase. Okay? Who's there? What do we call this cheater? How can my daughter disappear without telling anyone how we are about? What if something happens to her? Mom, nothing will happen to Tonya. After all, she's a big girl. She can take good care of herself. No, 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 no. I disagree with you, Gina. No big girl behave this way. Big girls inform someone where they are going, should anything happen. Nothing will happen to her, okay? Just relax. Nothing will happen to her, I assure you. This is what I keep saying to the ears of my husband. But he ignored me. He went to the police station and led a complaint. And the police is on it. Oh God, Tonya, where are you? Why are you doing this? Mom, please. Relax. I will keep searching for her and I'll keep asking friends to see if they know her whereabouts. It's all good. <laughs> Donia should pray <laughs> that nothing happens to her before the police get to her. Nothing will happen to her. I pray so. Stupid girl. Others came to say for the betterment of her kingdom. But she, she came lately came so the prince can notice you. You have seen how you're being noticed and not sure. Uh -uh. If you want, what is it? Why are you insulting her like that? Why won't I attack her? Eh? Why won't I attack her? So if you're being asked now, you said that we all came here for the same purpose, Abby? Who told you? Who told you that we came here for the same purpose? Mary! Mary, we all came here for the same purpose, and that is to serve. Even if we all came here for the same purpose, the main purpose we are here is to serve. What, what really happened if anyone? What is it? What brought about this purpose of a thing? Oh. Imagine Tonya trying to compare herself because she thinks her family is well to do. Not be only well to do. Is my family not well to do? But I'm here at the palace serving. Uh. All because I love their job now. <laughs> <laughs> if she feels her family is well to do, then she should chase the prince outside the palace and save herself some embarrassment. As long as we all are here, no one is bigger than anyone. Now, wow. Now, now get in a mouth, Sha. Tonya, what is it? What happened? I don't blame you. You have your mouth and you can say whatever you deem fit. You all are called. I don't know why you are all are attacking her like that. I don't understand. What is it? So much gossip in this in this palace. Mary, I beg her. Oh, she oh, made yeah. it so she brought it on herself. Let's go. Because I don't want you. Won't you stand up? What is it? You want to attack me now? I'm not only out because I will give it to you hot off. Facility that we know. Plenty sacrifice for love. Hey, calm down, calm down. You can't avoid me forever. The earlier you accept my request, better for you. You must be delusional. Is there something wrong with your head? Are you mad? Why would you touch me like that? Do I look like your mate in this palace? Hey, hey, stop it. I'm okay. If you dare try me again, I'll make sure I report you to the queen. I'll make you yeah. Don't touch me. Class. Collis. What is wrong with you? Are you out of your mind? 
Did he touch you? Did he touch you? He won't try it. If he dares me, I'll break his head and leave this palace at once. I will suggest you report him to Her Majesty so that he won't try that again next time. Don't worry. I wouldn't want to heat up things. There will be no need reporting him to the Majesty. As someone who has been here before you, I will still suggest you report him to Her Majesty. I appreciate your concern, but don't worry. I wouldn't want to heat things up. Okay. Thank you. He wouldn't dare. Sam, this is unheard of. You're telling me that you don't know your friends were about and you're literally doing nothing about it? I had issue with uh, Rita. Ever since then, Fred has found it so difficult to forgive me from his heart. He does not share anything with me. I have tried to reach him with all his contact that I have to no avail, so I don't know what else to do. Wait, does this mean that they've traveled out? Yes, because I overheard them discussing about it. No, no, no. Travel out. No, 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 no. Fred can do that. He's far too bigger than that. Even if he does. So many things is at stake because he is the prince of his kingdom. Okay, Sam, then let's go to let's go to his kingdom. Yes, let's go to his kingdom because I am no longer finding this funny. Let's let's go and make some inquiries. What what kind of inquiries? What if he is not there? And we went and unveiled some certain things he do not want his uh, king's men to know. What am I going to do then? Uh, please don't uh, initiate me into that. Oh, I have not even come out of the one I committed and you want to create another trouble for me. Uh, no, I'm not in for that. Okay, let's go to his office. Yes, at least we can, we can get something from there as well. Uh, what do you think you can get from his company? He must have told them otherwise. Oh. Wait. Did I hear you say his company? Yes. Wait, what do you mean his company? Okay, we don't know. Oh, that's one of his family's uh, company. You know, Fred, my guy, is a very simple guy. He lives his life on a low. So, wow. he's a very simple guy. He doesn't like all those uh, unnecessary announcements. Wow, wow. This guy is so secretive. Very, very secretive. Now, how do they expect us to know their way about if they keep being this secretive? How? Very simple. You will stay. They will find you and come. Not you going for them. You are trying to work there now. Yeah, yeah, no, I try to give you. I will Very well then. Uh -huh. Very well. Okay. You may enter. How is Tonya? I hope she's faring well. Be sure to join in getting her acquainted with everything in this palace. It's not easy for one to get used to things here in a short space of time. Yes, my prince. She's doing very well. What is it? My prince, it's about what happened some hours ago. What happened? That's a question. Nothing. Nothing, my prince. If you move an inch, I will deal with you decisively. I'm sorry, my prince. 
What is it you wanted to tell me? What happened? If you all continue to take my simplicity for granted, then you leave me no choice but to treat you exactly how everybody expects me to treat you. And you know it's not my style, but this time I will not flinch. I wouldn't give a damn. As for you, Collins, Serve severe punishment and salary deduction until you learn to mind your business in this palace. If you want a woman, go out there to the hotels, the brothels, roadside. Pick one and do what you want to do. Don't come to this palace and be, and be fondling with your co-workers. There's something wrong with you. No, my prince. My prince, I'm very, very sorry. I promise it won't happen again, please. Collins, did it occur to you that your behavior might bring costs upon you and your entire household? Do you know what this kingdom stands for? My prince. I'm, I'm very sorry. Please, forgive me. I, I, I promise I, I won't do it again. Prince, my... Please, my prince. I'm very sorry. Please. Who amongst you reported the case to the prince? Who was molested amongst you? Tonya, I am asking you. My queen, I swear to God, I never reported the issue to the prince. I never told him anything. I had wanted to give you a simple punishment because all the maid's eyes are going towards your direction. And you're lying about it. For that you will go without food for days until I am satisfied. My queen, I'm the person that reported to the prince. I did that so that colleagues would try that on someone else. Okay. So, why the prince and not me? I'm sorry, my queen. You went around, that's why. Leave, all of you. Thank you, my queen. Sonia, come back here. You are one. You are one lucky child. I would have dealt with you. Now listen. I do not want this to repeat ever again. Am I understood? Leave. Thank you, my. Queen. Mary, I sincerely do not know how to appreciate you. Thank you for speaking out the truth in the presence of your queen. Thank you. I wonder what I would have done. You are welcome. I also did that for myself, you know. 
When I first came to the palace, Collis made such advancement on me. But trust me. Are you serious? Yes. <laughs> Thank you, Mary, for standing up for us. Collis has tried to force me into his room, not twice. But what is even wrong with him? Why is he acting like a mad dog? What are you saying? Did you forget the other night? He tried to rape me. If not for God that sent Kenneth my way to come and help me out, I don't know what would have become of me now. <laughs> well, just like the prince said though, if he so desires a woman, he should go outside the palace and go and get himself a cheap prostitute. Because we are not one. Especially me, if anyone. Maki Chakama Ha! If you also want a relationship with any of us, you should come out and speak up and stop acting like a dog. Who would even accept him? I wonder. Definitely not me. <laughs> and, and the worst part is that he makes it look like we are the one coming after him when we go to report. Mm -hmm. But thank you so much, Mary, thank for you. coming up for us. We really do appreciate it. Thank, thank you. Thank you. We are welcome. We are Collins. Collins. One day you will just chase all of us out of this palace because of this your silly behavior. What do you mean by that? Eh? When I was giving punishment and my salary to the doctor, were you affected? See, Collins, that's not what you mean. I mean, you need to treat these girls with caution. Yes. So let me tell you, these people can be safe and they can also be killed at the same time. I keep telling you this, but you wouldn't listen. And the prince has told you the same thing. I keep telling you, Collins, if you need this girl so badly, go out there and get one for yourself. You're right. And believe me, they will all chase you with gifts. Yes. Just because they will know that this guy is working in the palace. Not doing all this palace stuff, man. See, me and Nofi run Palace Matao, and they tell you because all this basically they happen here and I embarrass me. What I won't take is you guys getting me angry. You guys should allow me to live my life the way I want. This is my life. And that is, that is why we are trying to explain to you that that same life will affect all of us one day. Exactly. Leave me alone. See, guys, let me tell you guys one secret. I once dated a maid in this palace. Yes, that was before you guys came. And we were both having fun, you no, know, catching our crews. How did I do it? I do it on a kunkun level, on a low key level. Nobody knew about it. Man, that's exactly the way I want you to be doing this thing. Yes. So, what's your point? My point is that whenever you want to do this thing, bro, do it on a secret way. That way, nobody will find out. Simple. Trust me. You'll be fine, can, boy. Can, can Are these girls going to run forward. after you? Thank you. And see, I know you will not listen to us. I told you guys. He's doing this again. See, if Colin is not listening to us, we will so deal with him in this palace. Don't worry, I know how to I want to honor law. I want to honor law. Don't worry. Okay, don't worry. Let's go to our house. If that job is giving his palace. It's okay, don't worry, don't worry. No problem. Maybe. Yes. Today, mm -hmm. we're going to have so much fun. All right. Anything <laughs> to make you happy. You know I love to hear that. Certainly. Yeah. Anything you want, <laughs> I will do just to, uh, to make you happy. You know what? Yeah. Something just came up. I just realized that I'm supposed to be in a meeting right now. Uh, and, and it's like a Zoom meeting, I have to be online, I don't have to move around, I have to be in my home office. So why don't you just move on with the driver, I'll join you later. Listen, the meeting is important and, 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 and I cannot miss it, okay? Important more than your wife. Take the car. Your queen. They will take you anywhere your you want to go. Don't say that. Now get into the car. No, I can't. Don't tell me that. So Calm you want down. to tell me the meeting Listen. is more Calm important. Down. Calm down. I know you. I'll make it up to you, don't okay? Tell me, don't tell me you'll make it I up to me. To Today is my day, and don't allow me to unleash my anger on you. Don't allow me. Fred! Don't do that! Please! You can't do that to me! Fred! Fred, come on! Come on! 
Why are you ghosting me? If you don't love me, tell me straight up. Because I'm a woman. Talk to me about it and stop treating me like some girl or someone you just picked on the street. Not every time I come here, I end up leaving very sad. Oh. Joy, please, can, can you keep it down? I'm sure he will come back to his senses. Senses? Don't, don't sound like that. Senses, mother? What do you mean by that? I will explain that to you. What Her Majesty is trying to say is there is no us. Can't you see it? You're so blind to see that there is no us. All my efforts, my time, and everything. You don't see it. Why? Because you feel you have someone else. So you treat me like a commoner, a girl you just picked on the street? Is that it? You need to come back to your senses and know that it's time you treat me like your woman, a true princess that I am. Your Majesty, please, I beg to take my leave. Thank you. Mother, why are you looking at me as if I did something wrong? Hmm? No. You, you, you didn't do anything wrong. You're practically doing good. Oh. Perfectly doing good. Send me the sarcasm. Congratulations. Sarcasm. Say your mind. What is it? I don't blame you. If you know what it took me to get her coming your way, you will know that she's a goal to preserve with all your mind. Oh. You've gotten what you wanted. You've gotten your plan, working against joy. Congratulations! Mom, come on. Calm down, okay? Why are you being so dramatic about this? Please, look, look, look. Don't get me wrong, okay? The girl is actually a nice girl, but maybe for somebody else, not me. I don't like her. She's not my type. I don't love her. Okay? So, it's best I just come out with it than pretending because it's beginning to piss me off. Each time she's here, it makes me feel sad because I know how this whole thing makes Tonya feel. It's almost like I'm so... What? Shush, that's your mouth. Mother. Don't talk gibberish. What has come over you? How could you be... Treating a princess who travel all the way from Hapolis to this place to love you till eternity. And all you could offer is to treat her so badly. Now listen. I advise you to stick to Joy, who is ready to give you peace. Love you like no other than minding a person who is here on her own accord. And that's exactly what I'll do. The right decision. Because that will determine my future. Not your future. And no one else's. So allow me to take the right decision for myself. Mother. Taking this too seriously. You will give yourself high BP. Fred! Calm down, mother. It's not that serious. Fred! I hope you don't regret this. <laughs> no, no, on a serious note, on a serious note. I, I, I like 
I like you a little ah, you kind man. You see the way you're just demonstrating. I like it. Ah, imagination wants to kill you. Stop. <laughs> no, you, 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 you. Look at your eyes. This you girl, like, she like, you, you like want me. your husband to be like the prince. Uh, yes. Ah. <laughs> hey! Stop <laughs> my Why can't I speak my mind? Here you are, Tonya. Yes. I'm here chit chatting, having a discussion, and having fun with my colleagues. Please, go help me tidying up the room. You know, it's my turn to sweep and mop everywhere, and I'm tired already. Mm. Why do you want to cut this happiness short? Uh -huh. Why? Wow. Yeah, let's go and arrange it. Yeah, come this way now. I thought it's our room you want to arrange. The Inside? One the, yes, the one in the main building. Um. Girls, girls, don't miss Bye. me. I, will I don't want to I miss you. I don't want to miss you. I want you. Seriously. So you want to say that? I want to say Plenty sacrifice for love, nigga. I fit to do anything. For sweeted animal. I fit to do anything. For my love, I fit to do anything. For sweeted animal. You will be loved. The prince is waiting for you inside. What does he want from me? Are you asking me? Maybe my head. Go inside, Jare. Be fast now. He's waiting. One shall I render to G. Hey, hey, hey. Come. I'm not going inside there. Of course, I'm going inside to get something. Okay. Tonya is arranging the room. She's putting the room in order. I don't want you to go in there and mess up the room for her. Please, you can go back. Wait. So, because Tonya is fixing the room, I shouldn't go inside to get what I want. Is that what you're saying? Please go back. Ha. Now, wow. Okay. Because Tonya, Tonya is cleaning so somebody cannot go inside again. Sonia, my baby, look, I just want you to know that I'm very sorry for everything you've been through. I'm so sorry about everything. I'm just playing along in this script my mother gave you. And, and the part of the princess, I had no part in it. I don't know how that happened, honestly. I'm sorry. Look, all I just want is to be with you. And I'm ready to do anything. If I may ask, how on earth did you agree in this crazy way to show your love to Her Majesty? My dear, I can't tell. I can't find any concrete reason that I agreed to do this for. I can't really say, sincerely speaking. I you think it's really worth it? Yes, I would say it's worth it. Fred is a good... Oh, sorry, the prince is a good man. And um, he's worth all the sacrifices. I'm just worried about my family. I don't know what's going on there. What do you mean by that? They don't know my whereabouts. You must be kidding me. I'm serious. <laughs> this is unbelievable. You requested to see me. Yes, my queen. Please permit me to go see my parents. It's been a long time since I saw them. Of course, I will permit you to go see your parents. But be rest assured that you are staying only for one week. 
And if you think that when you leave, my son will come visit you, think otherwise. Because he's not stepping out of this palace for one good week. Now listen, be careful when you're there. Because we are watching you. Thank you, my queen. You can leave. Thank you, my queen. Plenty sacrifice for love, nigga. I fit to do anything. Facilitated, I fit to do anything. For my love, I fit to do anything. Facilitated, I live. You were with me, love. You were with me, you're my choice. Now you're there, my heart. You were with me, love. You're my no mind them at all, love more. My heart is made up for you. I will stand for you day and night. Mother, I I don't think I've seen Tonya around today. Look at this boy. Is that why you demanded to see me? Is that a bad reason to see you? Come on. She's someone I should care about because she might end up being in my future. Is there a law that forbids me from caring about her? Of course there is a law as long as this kingdom is concerned. It is a taboo for a prince to be in love with a maid or a girl in her class. It is an abomination. So, take note. Mother, don't deviate from the question. Well, I sent her on an errand. For what? To fulfill a task. What task? Huh? Oh, Fred. You will know when it's done. I fit to do anything. Facility that we know. Plenty sacrifice for love. Nigga, I fit to do anything. Tony and I for you. You just disappeared into thin air without even letting me know your whereabouts. My darling, leave matter for Matthias. <laughs> if I may ask, where did you go to? Or what mission did you embark on? I went to the palace to see Fred's people. <laughs> I thought as much. So, is that what you're going to tell your parents? Because they are dead angry at you. Don't worry, when I get to the bridge, I'll cross it. Really? You think it's a joking matter? Who is joking? I'll handle my parents. Wow. You did absolutely wrong, Tony. How can you embark on such a journey without alerting your family? What if something had gone wrong? Cecilia, where did your daughter tell you she went to? My husband, your daughter is here. So you can ask her so she can tell you the same thing she told me. Um, okay, I'm so sorry. It wasn't intentional. A friend of mine called me and said that they're having one... There's this um, search, something like ultimate search and good ultimate search. You all know how I love adventure. So when she called me, I decided to embark on it. If I'd waited for your approval, I would have missed it. I'm so sorry. And where is the location? Okay, the place? Ogun State. And you didn't deem it fit to call anybody. What were you thinking? I, my, my initial plan was to call when I get inside the place. But when we got to the gates, they took all our phones. Sorry, Dad, I missed you. Plenty sacrifice for love, nigga. I fit to do anything. Facilitate, I live. I fit to do anything. For my love.
You can lie to me. I know the kind of father I have. I had to be creative. Oh, this is the greatest lie I've heard in this entire life. Do you think they believe me? Well, from the look of things, I think they believe you for now. But what if they get to find out? Your voice. They won't find out except someone tells them. And why are you giving me that? Do you think I'll, I'll send you out? Listen, I know who my dad is. I had to say whatever to make sure he doesn't get me caught. Well, you still have a lot of cover up to do. Don't worry, I got me. Let me walk you. Son, <sighs> who called you? Or whom did you call? Because telling the guards to clean up your car is of no use. Uh, Mother, look. My friend's father's birthday is tonight. And I have to go. I'm sorry you're not leaving this palace till one week. Or do you want us to call that your friend to ascertain? Come on, Mother. You're beginning to treat me like a child. Like I don't know my left from right. And that's not fair. I know. Well, as long as the throne of this kingdom is concerned, you are my number one priority. So what your father would have done is what I'm doing. Okay, let's make it clear. If you go out to see Tonya, be rest assured that She's not going to return to this palace again, and that's final. Or do I make it more easier? If you're so eager to go out, I will invite Princess Joy to accompany you to wherever you want to go. How about that? Hmm? So, sweetheart, relax. Oh dear, I'm sorry I can't come out right now. My mother grounded me. In fact, for the next one week, I can't leave the palace. <laughs> she even said that if I must leave, then she will instruct Joy to accompany me. Can you imagine? I mean, my mom treats me like a child. I don't know. I don't know what's wrong with her. Look, just don't worry. Don't let it bother you. I have my ways. I'll surely come out to see you. Talk to you soon. So, my prince, how is it going concerning your plan? Because your time to get married is fast approaching. It's going well, I know. But even if I was ready to get married today, my mother is still adamant on making the choice of a bride for me. What do we call that? I don't know. I cannot explain. You shouldn't forget the plan. So that another family doesn't look towards the throne. You know what that means. I know. And I hope my mother, the queen mother of this kingdom, knows too. Of course. She has been present in all the meetings conducted concerning it, especially you. So there is no way she will say she doesn't know anything that is going on. 
and what is demanded of even the royal family. She knows. Love, love. My heart is made up for you. I will stand for you day okay. and night. No matter the I am made to understand from the discussion I had with the prince that you are strongly disagreeing with his choice of wife to marry. Yes, of course, or no one. With all due respect, if I may ask my queen, why? Well, oh no, well, I have decided that I don't want to have my son going to depression again. So my word still stands. Any woman that wants to be with my son must go through me. And that's final. It's okay. I appreciate your efforts, my queen. Thank you once again, oh no. Uh, let it not look like I'm asking too many questions, my queen. No! It shows that you care. You want to know. You are really a true representative of His Royal Majesty. It shows that you, you've been with him in this palace for quite so many years and you understood him so well. Hmm. May his gentle soul rest in perfect peace. Well, for the girl in question again, if you are asked to assess her, what will be your score? Love My heart is made up for you. I will stand for you day and night. No matter the threat and the hate you. You're my choice. The day I met you, can you my love to love more? I fit the way to do you for my love. I fit the way to do you for sweet and more. Plenty sacrifice for love, nigga. I fit the way to do you for sweet and more. I fit the way. Oh my goodness, what is this? 
What should I do now? Should I call the prince? No. Should I call Gina? To come and join me? That wouldn't be necessary. I have evidence. Let me wait a while and see what's going on. I pray they come out again. Princess Joy. <laughs> Unbelievable. Regina, how are you? I'm fine, thank you. How are you doing? I'm good. What about Sonia, your friend? Has she disappeared again? Come on, mom. <laughs> she didn't disappear. She saw some of her old time friends, so she decided to catch up with them. What she asked me to do this. So all this here are for you. What do we call it? What she should have done is to go along with you. Or the person in man. Ah, mom, it's not what you think. Gina, I can think anything now. Anything. Because your friend is able and capable. In fact, she has shown us that she can disappear to reappear whenever she likes. So I can think anything. Oh, yes. Mom, take a chill pill. She'll be back before you know it. Okay? So relax. So, okay, Jack. So, wow. Hmm, my queen, so this is the lady you want your son, the prince, to marry. I wouldn't let that happen. Even if things didn't work out between the prince and I, the prince will not marry this girl that is moving about in and out with another man. I won't let it happen. She's not what she claims she is. I'll see to the end of it. They've been in there for over an hour. My heart belongs to you by 
Move. Bro, on guard. Gina, there is something that has been bothering me. Okay, so what is it? It's Fred. Fred has refused to take my calls, nor return them. All the text messages I have sent to him, none has been replied. If Fred, my good friend, could react this way because of what transpired a long time ago, then he never acknowledged me as a friend. Really? Okay, Sam. I am going to be so honest with you. Okay. If I find out that Tonya is having an affair with my man behind my back, honestly, I will never forgive her. I can't forgive her, yes, because it is not that easy to forgive. So I expect you to take up the blames. I'm not trying to find who to put the blames on. Put
put the blame on yourself for betraying your own best friend. <sighs> um, I've heard you. You are so you. So blunt. But the truth still remains. I have tried talking to my friend. I have spoken to him several. I have even apologized to him. But my friend has refused to utter a word. I'm going to ask you a very simple question. And I expect an honest answer from you. Okay. Let's say for instance, you get back home and find your friend, your best friend, having an affair with your wife or your woman. Are you going to forgive him that easily and move on like nothing ever happened? Never. My mother won. Wow. Interesting. So what are we now talking about? No, answer me. What are we arguing about? It is not that easy to forgive. And you expect him to just forgive you like nothing ever happened? Take up this blame and 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 do what is necessary. Do what you what you ought to do. And not, and not all these things you're talking about here. If you hadn't betrayed your friend, you would have been in the best position to sort out things for us now. Okay. I have heard what you say. I will try my best till your mind comes. Better. Uh, but I don't want to go to that palace without him inviting me. Why do you keep following us? Tonya, right? Exactly. What do you intend to achieve? I'm asking you! It's even the look for me. Why are you blinking your eyes? Like, I don't get it. Who are you? And why are you dressed like this? with makeup, lashes, and then she's even driving a car of almost 10 million naira. Who the hell are you? I ask you. I should be the one asking you. <gasps> Who exactly are you? And why are you parading yourself as a princess just to marry the prince? Listen. Listen, Tonya. This is not about being smart or being smart. You could lose your life in this game you want to play. Why would you want to kill me? Simply because I coincidentally stumble on something? Is that why you want to be a murderer? Oh, oh, oh darling, just calm down. You need cold juice or you want tea or coffee? Which one do you want? Why will anybody kill you? Nobody will kill you. <laughs> it's just the guards for me. The way you're just very proud, you know? Saying all nonsense, but not to worry. You need a very cold juice because I can see your temperature. No, is I rising. don't need juice. A glass of chilled water would do. Exactly. Thank you. Your temperature is rising. Look at this mugu. When are you guys taking me out of this place, please? Make it quiet. Cecilia. I called you out to find out from you. What sort of this stupid character displays your daughter displaying of recent? What is going on with her? Ah, uh, uh, my husband. Oh, now she is my daughter. But all this while she goes out to win awards. She is our child, isn't it? Cecilia, I am not caught out of this for these jokes. Please. What did this Gina say Tonya went out with? That's what I can't answer. Even Gina couldn't tell me any particular person Tony I went after. I sensed it when Gina came back with the provision. This stupid character of hers has to stop. How do we know when she is in danger? The worst of it is that she would refuse to pick her call so that we can't reach her. What sort of rubbish is that? No, no. I, I have called Gina severally. And she said she's even worried that Tonya has not called her. What is all this? Where could this girl be? Ah. God, 
Let nothing happen to my daughter. I pray nothing will happen to her. stupid. Knowing fully well that we'll be worried. Look at what you put us through before. And she's doing it again. Honestly, sir, it baffles me that her phones are still switched off. I called her severally. One of the lines connected and went off after a while. My God, where do I go to look for this girl? And the police might not listen to me this time around. My husband, you have to try and meet your friend, the DP, so you don't conclude yet. All we have to do now is to go out there and look for her. And look for her where? Where do we look for her? Oh my God. And I, I didn't even get to see the people she ran after. But wait, wait a minute. I, I, I think I have an idea. How about we go into the supermarket with police warrants and demand for their CCTV footage? That's a good idea. A brilliant one. Let's go. Let's go. Mother, mm. why is the prince not coming down to see me? Um, this is okay. Mm. Come here. Come take the tray. Serve her well. I'm sorry, my queen. Thank you. <laughs> Sorry about that. Mother, it's alright. I'm used to low lives. <laughs> Mother, you know I was just missing him so much. Uh oh. I couldn't even sleep. I just oh, wanted to just see his dear. face and also to see your smile. Oh, you know, I'm good. <laughs> always looking gorgeous. <laughs> yes, yeah, baby. <laughs> that is why you're my mommy. <laughs> So, yeah, so, so what about um, that, that little rat, that rat? Where is she? Oh, you mean Tonya? Is that honey? Yes. Mm. I think so. Okay. What about her? Is she around? Oh, 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 she left to see her parents. I gave her a week off. Oh, I see. Mm. Okay. <laughs> it's everything okay? Of course. Of course, mother. Everything is fine, you know. I was just going around the whole palace to take some fresh air. 
So I notice I haven't seen her around. You know, she's always everywhere, trying to be on everybody's face. So I just thought I should just ask about her. Not as if she's important. She's not. Oh, joy. <laughs> I have a I hope all is well. Of course. Are you sure everything is right? Yeah. Mother, you know the last time I came here, she actually spoiled my day. Oh. You know? I just don't like her. Oh, yeah. Sorry about that. <laughs> <laughs> what do we call this Jacob? Just like my husband said, these people seem to know what they came to do. And we couldn't get their faces at the CCTV camera. Both back and side view wouldn't give us anything. Oh, you're right. But I guess it's because of their camera angles. And I don't even know who these people are. Ah, why Tonya is behaving like this? Why? But adventure anything happens to her. I mean, how can one vouch for her? How? Exactly what I'm saying, Cecilia. It seems like I can't vouch my daughter anymore. I don't know her anymore. Could you believe that my friend I called to inquire about the ultimate side that Tonya told her she went to Logan State? He called me back to say there's nothing of such. Nothing like that! Huh. Tony. That means Tonya lied to all of us. Yes, that's what I'm saying. She lied to us. She deceived us. What's she up to? I don't even know. How? Oh. How? How can one know her best friend if she behaves like this? How? No. I am as confused and as surprised as everyone here is. Sonia has left me in the loop. I, I don't know what is happening. I can't even get to wrap it around my head. She lacks nothing. Nothing goes forever. Are you sure you know with any man? Ah, that Tonya is not that kind of a person. But Gina, yesterday you went out with her. And you came back along with the things you said she bought. Yet, she's not back. So what is going on? I don't get it. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what is going on, honestly. I am as confused as you are. <laughs> and are you sure she's not under the influence of alcohol or drug? Dad, I know that Tonya has put us through much stress of late. But honestly, she has not crossed that line. I can assure you that. Are you sure of that? Yes, sir. Can you vouch for her? Yes, sir. I am very sure. Why do you try your best to avoid me each time I come here? Nothing, really. Um, I believe with time, the chemistry will flow. For how long? Yeah. If you want me to be coming here, like every day, I would do that. No, 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 no. You can't do that. You can't keep doing that. Look. I've barely had time for you the few times that you've been around. Huh? Let's do it this way. Uh, how about I come to your kingdom? Huh? Yes. Let's turn it around. I'll be visiting you from time to time. That way we can catch up and make up for lost time. Yeah, <laughs> that would have been nice. But I wouldn't want to announce you like that to my parents. Yeah, I want us to, you know, Build what we have mm. and be sure that you know, love each other and be with each other. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that way you can come around. All the while I've been coming here, my parents are not aware. I sneak out without any maid or guard, so if they find out I'm finished, mm. Mm, Joy will be in a big problem. So you just take it easy. Let me do the coming. And we don't want that. No, you wouldn't want your baby to be in trouble. So it's kind of a secret secret. Yeah. I get it. I get it. <laughs> um. Remind me the name of your kingdom again. 
<laughs> my prince, is, is it that you forgot my kingdom? I'm so sorry, okay? A lot on my mind, but I promise, I promise you, on my own, this is the last time I would ask you this question again. Ah, uh, okay. What is the name of your kingdom? Umu Belago Tunga. <laughs> Umu Belago. Yes. <laughs> okay. Interesting. I hope you won't forget. No. Never. <laughs> I will never forget. Umu Belago, right? Yeah. I got it now. Well, Gina, what new boyfriend are you talking about that your friend has found? And since when? I thought you think has slowed down from anything relationship. What is going on? <sighs> Sir, Tonya met someone and was hiding him from me. I recently found out about it. After she returned, she brought him to my house and introduced him to me. She said that she would bring him you know, to you for proper introduction after she must have gotten to know him better. And he's already talking about marriage. He is a prince. A prince? Of which kingdom? That I don't know, but I can find out. Please do. She's your friend. Okay, ma'am. Kevin, what are you saying? 
can you imagine no need for me to run outside thinking that my gate man apprehended her? And I found the gate wide open. That she ran away? How? How did she run away? What, what was wrong with you? Come on thing, you can do it. I am here trying to cover my own end. And the little thing you're supposed to do, you just messed it up. Eh? What's your problem? What's your problem now? No, how can you say this in this situation? Stop lying. Stop lying. What do you mean she kicked you? Or you tried to lure her into sleeping with you? How will she come close to you? Does she have strength? Uh, listen, I only called you for us to know what we'll do to her car before the police come here and start looking for her. See, the only thing I'm going to tell you now, look for that Tonya girl and fix her. Yes, you heard me. Look for her and fix her. I will join you soon. Excuse me. My friend. Jesus Christ. Me. What is the problem with you? Sorry, it wasn't intentional. Why, why are you sneaking in like a thief? I will explain to you later. I need my bag I left here. I need it immediately. Please. What for? I said I need it. Please. I need to save the prince and his mother. I just hope your parents will be happy to hear this you're saying. I am talking to you about something very important and you're telling me about a bag you need to save the whole world. I will with. explain to you later. I have no time. I guess it's in the room. Tonya! I will explain later. Mother, I knew it. I knew it! I knew it! There was something wrong with that girl. I knew it. What I knew there was something, something fishy with that girl. What girl? Your princess, of course. Oh, Fred, what is it again? Have you seen why this girl keeps saying that you doesn't like her, you doesn't show interest, like she is your worst nightmare? She is. Look at this. Pay attention to my journal. Now stay with me. The first time I met this girl, I asked her, which kingdom are you from? She said, Omochida. Mm -hmm. And today, I asked her, same question. Same question. And you know what she said? Mm -hmm. She is from Omobelago kingdom. Are you sure? How could that be? It's right there in my journal. It's right there. This could be a mistake. See, anyone can do this mistake. Can you? Are you sure she's a princess? Mother, are you sure she is who she said she is? Has he taken your calls? He has not to. Uh, that's what I'm saying. I'm trying to know what is going on with him. Even Regina has been calling to know one or two things. That's the boys down to what I ask you. For afraid not to pick your calls and not getting in touch with you, that means you offended him and you don't want to admit it. Prophetess Grace, if you are this good in prophecy, if you are this good in prophecy, you would have solved so many issues for me. I know you want to hear that me and my friend is having issues because of woman. Sorry to disappoint you, there is nothing like that. That is what you said. Hmm? 
if Fred is here, I will sincerely ask him and the truth will come out. Okay. Eh, but don't worry. On a very good day, the truth will come out and it will set two of us free. That is no problem. And I can assure you that that issue you want me and my friend to have, it will never happen. Okay? What's my business? Go to Sibasa. I was about going out when she bashed into the house. She said she came to pick something from the bag she came back with. So I had to sneak out to come and call you. And where is she now? She is still in my house. Let's go. you must marry on the whole So what do we do now? What do you do with her car? Should in case something goes wrong? Um, I think we should drive this car far away from this place. You can pack it up somewhere else. We're not the one to do that. We have to get someone that will drive the car there. And also get her phone and leave it inside the car. Okay? That's true. See, nobody on no account will we tell anyone that we saw her talk more of she coming into this place. We never saw her. She never came here. And we don't know her whereabouts. It's alright. But after that, we're leaving town. Leaving town? Why? What do you mean, why? Do you know if she has talked to somebody? <sighs> eh? Do you know if I have discussed with anybody? See, we don't have that time. Come, let's go. Maybe I don't buy this come. idea. How can we be scared of that girl like that? What do you mean? See, I don't want to get into trouble. Okay? Come, let's go. Baby, you're not getting into trouble. Don't you get it? My friend, listen to me. Come, let's go. Oh, God. What's your problem? Really? Nami, you must marry. I can't do anything to get to you. Where is she? Uh, Ma, Ma, I left her here before I came to call you people, but I'm surprised I can't find her. Zena, my daughter, why not tell us what is going on? Ma, my husband, you don't need to attack Gina in this manner. If you do, she won't be able to relate anything to us again if she gets to find out anything. Is she not her best friend? Your daughter, my decided or decide to hide things from her. No, I don't believe that. They share everything together. They relate with each other. She knows what is going on. She's just pretending because sense is like this. I still don't believe so, my husband. Can't you see that Gina is scared already? What we do now is to make sure we have positive answer to get our child back. Please. So? Yes, I do. I called you too because I want you guys to mount at the end of the street. If you see any signal that you don't understand, give us a call. Do I make myself clear? Now listen, you two. I want you two to be very, very vigilant. If you see that girl coming anywhere close to this house, do not hesitate to call us. Did I make myself clear? Mama, see, you see this case? Now come on case. We go run now two seconds. As far as say, shall you the highness, the men will step down the wait now. That won't be a problem. I will arrange some money for you guys. One more thing. I want you two to put your eyes on that car. If you see anyone going towards it, 
let me know as well. That's small matter be that now. As far as money is involved, we dig game. It's all right. Let me arrange some money for you guys. Oh, Alana, we're we'll going to wait for you. Musa! Just got the complete information that she's around. Yes. So that is it. So you guys can swing into action immediately. That is it. <laughs> That's good. Look, let me tell you guys. I'm expecting good news from you guys as soon as possible. Good news. No stories. <laughs> no says. Ah. Mm -hmm. By the time I'm done with them, <laughs> they, they will know that somebody is on the pipeline. It's okay. <sighs> Greetings, my queen. Greetings, my prince. What happened? You were supposed to return yesterday. It wasn't intentional, my queen. I was kidnapped. Kidnapped? Yes. Are you, are you sure of what you just said? Yes, my queen. I can't lie before your presence. I'm certain I was kidnapped. Wait, if you were kidnapped yesterday, how come you're here? Were you kidnapped from the palace? No, but luckily for me, I was able to hit the boy watching over me on his balls and escape. My goodness. This is serious. W were you able to recognize any of them? Yes, I did. So, who are they? Linda and her boyfriend. And who are those? Linda, your princess Joy is Linda. What? Hey, 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 hey. Hey, hey, hey. Do you know the consequences of what you just said? Yes, my queen. It's unbelievable. Hence, I made a video with my phone. I got them walking away. But the phone is in my car, which is still in their compound. Mother, I am calling the police right now to go over there with her. I need to call Joy. Her line is not connecting. Oh, this explains it. I now know why she came here to inquire about you yesterday. Oh, really? Oh, my God. Oh. Hello, officer. So here's the address. I know the village. Who gave you the address? His friend. After calling him on the phone and narrating what the situation is, he asked me to come over to the house and he gave me the address. Why didn't he come with you to take us there? My himself and Fred have look ahead, so he couldn't come with us. I know the village. Let's go. Okay. I don't do anything to get to you. You must marry me on the whole season. Marry me, marry me on the whole 
So why did you stop here? Tonya, I want to take this opportunity to apologize. <laughs> apologize over what? Everything. Every single thing that you have been through because of me. I am very sorry. Please. I know what you have gone through. And I feel bad about it. It's okay. Please. Everything will be alright. Okay? So... Thank you. Who is there? Do you know him? I... I don't. And someone is knocking here too. No, I don't. Who, who, who are these people? Jesus! What? Please. Shh. Oya, maintain. If you feel sustained. Please. Please. Behave yourself. Okay, calm down. Shh. Calm down. What do you want? Ball out! Ball out! Ball out! Ball out! Ball out! Ball out! Hey, hey, hey. hey. My heart is made up for you. I will stand for you day and night. No matter the threat and the hate you, you're my choice. The day I met you, can you mala live love I say, come here now. Where are you going to? Huh? Pay me my money. Madam Sosha, that's a man you are family like that. I don't lost my wallet. Now the strategy uh. where you want to go, I go change them for you now. What is the what problem? What's my business if you my lost wallet your wallet? Don't lose. Madam hey. Sosha, calm down, please. Calm down. What's the problem here? Ask him to pay me. Let him pay me my money. Madam, calm down. You are embarrassing me. What's the meaning of that? Embarrassment. No, no, say she guesses. I just lost my wallet, bros. All right, okay. Oh I my don't God. see Natalia. Pay me my money. Wait. You're not gonna like me, oh. Nah, me, Madam Sosha, I didn't oh, right. like this. All right. I just okay. finished eating. Oh. Ah, I don't even know. Madam Sosha, how much is the me. money? Five thousand nine hundred. Five thousand nine hundred. Yes. All right. Add that to my own bill. I will make transfer for you immediately. Okay. Are you sure? Of course. You are sure. Please, you can't be embarrassing him like this. Let him go. Let him go. Right? Just thank your God. Oh. But you are lucky. So, okay. Madam Sosha and me, Gerard, when they come here, they chop around the bar, chop up okay. behind it. Go, Go, Anna. Dragon, Dragon shall rise again. Dragon shall rise again. Your wallet. You mean my wallet? Yes. How did you find it? I saw it on the floor where I was rushing to get my mother something. Yes, when you were coming down and rushing in Madam Social Shop. I couldn't bring it because I was rushing to get my mother that stuff she used in cooking. Well, that's good. You see? You're a good boy. Thank you, sir. Lie! Never hide! Oh! You are a brother. You are a brother. I say lies! Never hide. It's such a drama king. Check, check if everything is intact. Hey! All my money intact! Hey! You were actually you, telling the truth. Of course! I can't lie. Why don't you give I'm the bigger than lies. Bless the boy with a little You don't need to tell me. I will bless you. <laughs> for this for you. Hey. No, wait, wait. Come on. Have this one. Thank you, sir. For Thank your you good, sir. good. Come, come. come. No. Uh -huh. You need, you deserve more. For this one. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. What you the Bless. 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 Fred. Sir. I don't know what I would have done when I found myself in the middle of a deep blue sea sinking. But then, Fred got my hand and spoke to Madame Susha. Count yourself lucky. Madame Susha will have embarrassed you beyond your imagination. <laughs> well, I just thank God I was vindicated. How? What do you mean? I just thank God when that small boy brought back my wallet in your presence. It was like a deliverance. I mean, a miracle. Maybe if we are not there, this whole story would have been a different ball game. And you will never believe me if tomorrow you see me or tomorrow I meet you to tell you all these stories. <laughs> 
yes, you're right. You're right. You shouldn't blame Madame Social. A lot of people have done her bad through that way. Oh, sir. Sir, not my kind. I'm too big for that now. Not my kind. Well, I just pray I will never make such mistake again. Never on earth will okay. I do such mistakes. It's okay. Man, I really appreciate you guys, you brothers for life. What happened? I thought you were a graduate. Why this? Yes, I am. But the bad government and the ugly situation of this country have turned me to a gangster. What's going on? What is going on? I don't know. I'm so scared. Whatever it is, I hope it's in our favor. Because as it is now, we are at their mercy. Guys, what do you they do? Eh? You should say you still there with me for this business. You don't spoil everything now. Calm down. Chlor. If you were my shoe, would you love to kill that guy? Bro, look into my eyes. I can't beat the finger that once fed me. Come on. Slow. See, make I tell you, but who will still get our balance? Who will still get what? Nah, nah, what for you? Relax. I will play Uno. Selena Dunes. In the sense that, eh? I'll tell Uno, see, who do accomplish the mission? Hmm? Okay, okay, wait, wait. wait. What you talk good do? Okay. What thing we go use show no we say we don't buy them as in where the evidence we will go show them. Because we got convinced and say we don't buy these people. Though. Fine. You know what, sir? I'll use picture. Uh -huh. Don't forget. I do make up for school now. God protect Just, us. It's okay. Just relax. What's going on? What is happening? Chill, chill. I need some money. Money? Yes. I need to get blood and make you a makeup. Yes, so I can convince you know that you're dead. So money. Let me accomplish this mission. Okay. Alright. Um give me your account number. Musa! Open the gate, open the gate. Musa, I don't account to you. I need to change for anybody. I understand you guys were doing this for money. There is no amount of money that is worth human life. So I want to make sure you guys don't go this lane anymore. I'm offering you 10 million naira right now to give up this lifestyle, to drop your guns and turn a new leaf. I told you, he's a generous person. I'm giving you an extra 10 million if you could tell me who was behind this. Who wanted to take my life and her life at the same time? Actually, it was that same man you took as a father. That same man you do everything for. Oh no. Ichi Amadi. Yes, he sent us. Echamadi is an evil man. As I speak to you, he's having our balance of 3 million naira. And we need to collect that balance from him. And after that, you need to do everything you want to do with him. You promised me you will not pick up the gun again. Yes. Let me have your number so we can stay in touch. Don't 
up to me. What up? How are you? I'm fine. How may I be of help, sir? Actually, we are here to see Tonya. Tonya, Tonya. Tonya, okay, you mean Tonya the maid servant? Yes, yes, Tonya the maid servant. Please, we're here to see her. What do you mean? Tonya, my daughter, maid servant? Okay, wait a minute, let me call her. Okay. I'm coming, let me. Wait a minute, let me go. Her. It's okay. What do you mean? You mean Tonya, my daughter, a maid servant? Ma, I, I don't know, but I would encourage you to have a little patience. When we get in, we will we'll know all we need to know, please. Ah! Gina. My heart is made up for you. I will stand for you day and night. No matter the threat. Listen, you cannot continue like this, okay? You need to put yourself together. Okay? Look. God. We are alive. And that gives us the time and opportunity to put things back in order. God. Huh? It's a small world. What if I listened and I minded my business and didn't come to Auntie Sosho's house that day? We would have met our Waterloo. Oh God. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. A good deed has given us a second chance. Yes. It's okay. Just calm down. We have to leave. Yes. All right? Don't mind them at all. Love them My heart is made up for you. I will stand for you. That's why we are here, Your Majesty. This is serious. You mean she never told you people about her quest for love? And with how I pressured her, she never wavered towards her goals to be with my son, the prince. She must, she must have gotten a good heart, a strong, strong heart. A very strong heart, Your Majesty, to the extent of not sharing anything with her best kid. Sir, are you saying that you never believed me all this while? No, all I'm saying is that I have never seen best friends not sharing things with each other. Well, then trying my son's line, they are not connecting. None. None is connecting at all. Needless of trying my daughter. Her phone has been switched off since she came back on this journey. But we will keep trying, my husband. Right. My heart is made up for you. I will stand for you day and night. No matter the threat and the hate, you. you're my choice. The day I met you, can you love me? Good night. I fit to do anything for my love. I fit to do anything. For sweet animal, plenty sacrifice for love. Mr. Moore, if I were you, you couldn't make that call. I don't understand, as in. Where is your second? Hey! Move, my friend. Get move. 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 <laughs> look, look, look at me. This is wonderful. You guys are really me. Yes, this is what I want. <laughs> yeah, at this point, I have to start preparing to ascend the throne of Umweze Shua Kingdom after the Nyam Festival. Hmm. Fred burial must have been done and dusted by then. And the mother should also be aware that it's all over for her and the palace. That's it. You can imagine a woman controlling an entire kingdom. Woman for that matter. Ha! That's, 
it. Just got it. <laughs> That's okay. Can we now have our balance? Yes. Let me go for it immediately. Hmm? Ah, yes. One more thing. I have a proposal again for you, another one. And that is, when I ascend the throne as the king, one more thing. I will still want to work with your team again. So that anyone who wants to raise his or her ugly head, will be taken care of by you guys. My kingship must be smooth and swift. Do I make myself clear? That's okay. Go. But we will think about it, your majesty. You can't say that again. <laughs> and that is it. So, I'm coming, let me go fight with it. I'm coming, let me just uh, run in. My heart is made up for you. I will stand for you day and night. No matter the threat and the hate you, you're my choice. The day I met you, can you give my love to love more? I fit to do anything for my love. I fit to do anything for sweet love. Let me sacrifice. Stop connecting. Hi. One more time. It's ringing now. Uh -huh. Thank God. Ah. Thank God. Dude. We have been trying your number since and it's not connecting. Yeah. It's fine. It's fine. Uh, we are through with Ono now. Yes. Sorry it took us some time, Sha. Okay. Good. It's nice knowing you, bro. Nice knowing you. My heart is made up for you. I will stand yes. for you day and night. No matter the threat and the hate you. You're my choice. The day I met you, can you my love no more? I just remembered I've not turned my phone on. Me too. And I just turned on my phone now. Okay, um, I need to talk to my friend. <laughs> Hello, Gina. Yes, yes. Where are you? We've been looking for you. What happened to you? 
Um, I heard everyone is looking for me. I just got back home with Fred. So where are you guys? You won't believe it if I tell you that we are at Fred's palace. His mom asks us to wait while she makes different calls trying to find out what is going on. Are you serious? Okay, wait, we'll be there. Okay? We're coming there. Okay. Did it go through? Yes. Let's go. Let's go. I need to go get my parents. Chicken, open the gate fast! Why I should love you Melt my heart Show me the reason Why I should love you What I need is love And peace of mind Can you give it to me Money not be everything Make a burrito Everything. Who else? If not the queen, if not those who are using me to run the kingdom, yet they assume royalty. You, you, you mean you say when I am Elisa? Yes, I'm in the court. Yes, my queen. This one you are calling. I hope all is well. Okay. All right, let me dress up immediately. I'll be with you soon. Yes, I'll be there. Thank you. <laughs> Hope all is well. Who oh, yes. else? I know it. Every time I'm muddy, I'm muddy, I'm muddy, they won't allow muddy to get to rest. Eh? Igwe, let's finish this meal. Very soon they will know. Yeah. Let's enjoy this meal. Let's go. <laughs> Our music again. Mm. Rushy, rushy, fire, fire, nigga, the on the horses, oh, bloody do, bloody do, on the hum, rushy, rushy, fire, fire, on the horses, oh, bloody be, bloody be, on the hum, bloody do, me, you must marry, on the horses, oh, bloody be, bloody be, on the hum, It's not possible. It is possible. Amadi, it is possible. You think you're seeing a ghost? Or ghosts? Now, we are alive and healthy. You failed. Your plans were foiled because of one good turn that deserved another. Unlike you, that took advantage of my goodness to you to strike. Bichia, madam. The unknown of this great kingdom. I don't know what to do with you. Only the gods of this land will curse you. 
gods, you will never know peace. Only the gods. No, is this sad? I don't know. Arrest him! Take him down! I don't know. Arrest him! Amadi, why are you running? Huh? Why are you running? You have the right to remain silent for whatever you say now or do is against you. Yes, so move. Oh no. I said, move it, 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 Marry me. 